Come on, man. You know the vibe. Microphone check. One, two. What is this? Welcome to episode 334 of the Joe Budden Podcast. I'm your humble, gracious, grateful, and highly favorite host, Joe Budden, here with a few really neat guys, man. To my right is, uh, what's your new name again? Raheem. Mm-hmm. Maul, a.k.a. Raheem. That's Maul's quarantine name. Uh, Parks it's not, is it's here. It's not Willie Wet Wipes? No. <laughs> Maul is in his house going ham with the wet wipes. Absolutely. And the baby wipes. It's yeah. true. Yeah. Willie Wet Wipes. Man. That's why when the toilet tissue sold out, I was like, wet wipes, the baby wipes are still here stocked. What you in there wiping down? Uh, everything. <laughs> everything. I'm wiping everything. Windows. With the baby wipes? Yeah. 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 Everything. That's his, that's his Clorox wipe. Yeah. No, I got those. That's how he's sanitizing everything. With baby wipes. <laughs> no, I got those two. That is more. I got the Lysol wipes. I got all that. Wiping down the shoes okay. and all that. Everything. Got to. Before a chick get in your bed, you baby wiping her feet down? Or no. Clor- Clorox wipe? No, Clorox no, wipe or... Uh, I mean, if you suck in the toes. Well, she's taking a shower. <laughs> not that that's happening. Put her in the bath. Let her, before, let her boil. That's, that's what you say. Not that, that that's happening. Do y'all hear that? I want y'all to highlight the not that that's happening part. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. It's things like I'm that. I'm quarantined that let alone. You, it's things like that that let you know someone may be listening out there. <laughs> no, that's not. It's I'm, little things. That's it's not in Atlanta. That that's, I'm quarantined. That's what it is. I'm lit- smart. Yeah. You're smart. Like for real? Hell yeah. You can jerk your way through Shut the quarantine. Up. Shut yeah. up, Maul. I'm dead Shut serious. Shut the fuck up. I'm dead I'm, serious, I'll be honest bro. with y'all. I'm not believing any of y'all single guys that are saying they're quarantining alone. It's got to be not, tough. I'm not buying y'all it at all. Sick, uh, I'm not. <laughs> I'm quarantined alone. I'm sure. not. Yeah. And I'm not pretending to. <laughs> no, I'm quarantined alone, for real. Yeah. Say something, Rory, while I find the company song. <laughs> the company song? <laughs> Maul, why won't you have company over? You don't know what people be at, man. What if she's quarantining in her house by herself? I don't know that. Maul has to grow up. I That's trust issues. I don't, I don't trust these hoes. You get her to uh, share a location. Well, why, does she have, why can't you invite maybe not a hoe? Oh, they're all hoes. <laughs> someone Maul, someone Maul, listen to the Maul, savage Maul, anthem. Maul. Have you been seeing your IG live lately? <laughs> <laughs> they're all hoes. And they're and they're living together. Yeah. Smoking hookah what, and shit. What, what is happening on your IG oh, live? Oh, my God. You don't see the girls still sharing hookahs? That's crazy. Oh, my gosh. Sharing hookahs? They're yeah. sharing niggas on IG live. <laughs> You, you, was the, you was the 6 p.m.? Huh? You was the 6 p.m. live uh, add-on? No, 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 not me. Okay. <laughs> I just keep getting sent links. They're like, yo, they giving it up over here. <laughs> Random nigga live. His chick's twerking naked. I'm like, yo, it's 5 o'clock on a Wednesday. Like, <laughs> Yeah. Yo, you know we have to stop doing this. They get into the bag. And I'm not, let me not say that, because maybe we don't have to stop doing this. What? <laughs> <laughs> it's fun when we do it, but... Like, we always talk about, like, the bottom of the barrel chicks. Like, <laughs> like they're <laughs> women... Like, they speak for all women. Yeah, like, they're the status like we quo. Don't nah, never, you, you know I'm the opposite of that. I don't do that. I'm just fucking around. Yeah, but we don't never say that we just fucking around. No, I do. I say, hey, yeah, I think we do. Yeah. And I always bring up that there's another group and type yeah. of women out and there. I, I never we put just talking about the bartenders. No, no, no. But why don't we ever talk about the rest of them? We talking about the, I'm talking about the hoes at the... No, I'm just saying because y'all don't hang out with them. No, listen, I'm talking about the hoes that the, hey. the women that the women that aren't hoes are talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Like the women that aren't hoes are talking about the hoes that I'm talking. Oh, about. so Wall speaks for the hoes that aren't the hoes. Yeah, yeah, but there's a uh... double negative. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, all right, got you. That's a positive. Cancels each other out. Because yeah. <laughs> the women that ain't hoes, they see what's going on the IG live now. They see it. Yeah, but I don't no, know. No, they're not even looking. I don't know. They're looking. I don't know if the chicks that. Me and Savon met at uh, Squarespace. Care about the escort rates dropping? I don't know. No, they don't no, no, care no, no. about it. Like we never. Talk I'm not about... saying they care about it, but they know about it. They know. They know what's happening. They got the newsletter. Yeah, yeah. They know. Uh, I saw a whole bunch of chicks surprised at how much Simba makes. <laughs> I saw a whole bunch of chicks that said Simba too. was lying too. I do not think Simba was lying. She's she's not making eighteen. Well, they said she's not making eighteen thousand a month. Only fans. Uh, some of them chicks have screenshotted y'all, what they make. Let me tell and you, y'all have Simba all the way fucked up. No, not me. I'm just saying some women were responding to that. Well, women are they haters. Hate. Women are yeah. haters. Okay. I do believe that women, some women are lying about what they're making. I do not believe Simba what? to be one of them. No. Okay. Simba go, Simba go to Dubai, Dubai for six months and come back and just wave hi to everybody in Brooklyn. Mm-hmm. <laughs> like, <laughs> That's um, true. Parks is here. Rory is here. Erickson is here. Savon is here. Alex the uh, Great is here. And Rim is here. How's everyone doing? Good. How are, you, how are you? That's it. How are you? Yeah, but but what comes with that? Oh, this is just the, sh- the whole world is in a relationship. That's what I took from this quarantine thing. Okay. Expound. Go on. Uh, the whole world is in a relationship with coronavirus. 
<laughs> okay. So, like, I you know how I if you're in a relationship. with a Maltese. <laughs> you know how you're in a relationship, like, you just, they just want you to stay home. Right. Don't watch sports. Right. Get off your video game. You, you, he's got a point. I was thinking about buying a video Everybody game. In a What's uh, a good video she, game to buy? She's a virus. Yeah. <laughs> she's not good for you. Stay away from her. Yeah. Bad for your health. Yeah. <laughs> she spreads around. That's touches touches everyone. Everybody's forced to be in a relationship and be home at a certain time. That's all. Listen, yeah. I'm, I'm enjoying it. Honestly. I like it. I would like to go to the bar, but... In some weird way, I think this gives us more time. It does give us more time. In a weird way. More time to, to do what? It just gives us more time to do whatever we want to do. That's a fact. Sing the songs that we want to sing. Yeah. yeah. For yourself. More time to think. More time to work on other things. More yeah, time I never to, have time to do shit. Until to, now. To, to I, do think that this is a, I do think that this is the universe hitting the reset button yeah. and yeah. Ma- making you reassess some things and take a look at some things. Sit and down. Place, yes. Relax. Everybody sit down. Think and, about some and things. And get your shit together. Yeah. I agree with that. That's yeah. all. Also, this virus made me highlight uh, the theory of mine that just like... Yeah, racism is nasty, but it's not going to be the end all, be all. (laughs) Expound. The virus doesn't care what color you are. Oh, true. No. Yeah. The aliens don't care what color you are. Well, we don't know. Um, What else? Aliens could be racist. When the dinosaurs come back, (laughs) when the animals come back. When the dinosaurs come back. Listen, however human extinction, extinction happens, because it is going to happen. For sure. I don't know if you guys believe that, but if you look at the past, you'll see the future. Human extinction will happen. So I I sit home and try to figure out how. And whenever that comes, racism is not going to be involved. That's that's why racism is always looked at as so stupid. Right. That's because humans are stupid. Oh, yeah. Very much. Very very fucking stupid. It is us. Absolutely. It is us. Um, we, we have egos and viruses don't. Yeah, viruses don't care. I just read uh, fucking they got uh, they got Doris. What's uh, they got Doris, Doris uh, Burke. Her. She oh, she tested positive for it. Tested positive for coronavirus. Man. See, they got face too. Right? Prayers I was about to say oh prayers God. to Scarface. Yeah, yeah, no, this virus got to chill out, man. Word they up. clearly don't know about the ghetto boys. <laughs> like, Word. Honestly, they never yeah. heard the fix. Yeah, chill. Have to. Fuck these other tricks. Look <laughs> 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 at Parks trying to sneak in. <laughs> boy, I, gave, I gave you another two bars this week. Oh, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. You want to write some shit? No. <laughs> <laughs> no. You can hold that. I don't, hold, hold on to yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. Wait till I get another six. Yeah, yeah, yeah keep that. Come on, don't, <laughs> don't give anything for free. Uh, yeah, how are you guys? How, how's everyone's mental health? Like, good, I know man. I know a lot of us hate ourselves, really, but we mask it. Yeah, for like, sure. Like, how is the time alone? I'm like, good, man. Like, is it fucking with you spiritually, mentally? Uh, what? Talk to me. No, nah, I'm... There's a heat check. It's a temp for, check. For me, the first, maybe the first few days was a little tough because it's like you didn't know exactly what was going on, where it was going, where, where's the end of this. But now, when you look at it, it just teaches you to appreciate every moment, live in the moment. And I think that's the one thing that coming out of this, I think people will do more. I think people will spend more time with each other. People will travel, get out more. And it's funny that I said that I, that was one thing I wanted to do was to get out more. And, and now look what happened. So it's definitely something that I think people should come out of this. You know, and, and that's why I'm at mentally. It's like just appreciate right now in the moment. Stay in the moment. Don't think too much about when this is over. You know, how long is this going to go on? Appreciate right now. You got your health. Your family's healthy. A lot of people are dying from this thing. Uh, you know, a lot of families are going through things and then you look at other places around the world and, you know, I, I heard somebody say, oh, this feels like I'm on lockdown. Like, this is not this lockdown. This is not lockdown. This right. is not being incarcerated. This is no. none yeah. of that. Lockdown you, was not me fighting the crackhead for the sleepy spot on yeah. the bench. Yeah. <laughs> this, is not, this is not that. This is just, you know, everything slows down. Everything, you know, just sit down, relax. Uh, you can't just go out and, and be around a bunch of people. With that. So that's, that's the biggest change for some people. People like to be out. But other than that, this is just a moment that to sit down and just live in the moment. Yeah. Appreciate the now and don't think too much about the future. Yeah, for me I'm for me well, for starters, for me this is the lifelong answer to the question that chicks have asked me every time I would say, "Hey, everything that you beef about to me is not important." And then they say, "Well, what's important?" Right. This. <laughs> right. Yeah. Like a yeah. pandemic. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And I I've, I've taken the construct of time I value that more now. Like, mm. days have passed pretty quickly and kind of been blurred together. I'm appreciating time a lot more now yeah. in, in the construct of it rather than just passing time, more or less, right. just for the fuck of it. Like, right. You're almost out that age group. 
of just letting shit go. <laughs> of yeah, because younger younger people, you know, we y'all feel like I have I have time. It, that's what yeah I have time more or less right. You you get into that point where yeah you gotta value it yeah, now. And, <laughs> yeah. It, and it's not like the days are are dragging. They're more just blended together. So the fact that it's Friday now, like Monday, seems like it was yesterday. Mm. Yeah, which yeah. is kind of scary. <laughs> yeah. Listen, let me tell you guys, I couldn't wait to come here and talk to you guys. I showered. <laughs> Appreciate that, man. Yeah, Thank man. You. Try to come in here with as less germs as possible. Appreciate that. It's nice of you. It's very nice of you. Thanks, you guys. Appreciate it. Um, where do y'all want to start? Where do y'all want to start? Uh, y'all, are y'all figuring out that your uh, your favorite artists are cornballs? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> your favorite athletes are cornballs? Do y'all see that? I haven't seen that too much. I always laugh when people like look up to people and that's my role model. I'm like, he's cornball. Are you and like, Tory Lane's beefing again? I don't have any beef with Tory. <laughs> I'm just starting. Maul got a long list of beef, of beef people. You and Charlamagne got to fight. Uh, let's do it. That was easy. Well, there you go. You guys could get a live in beef. I don't have I don't have a beef with him, but if, <laughs> yeah, get I would on, like to see that. Yeah, yeah like it. yo, set a time and you guys yeah, get on yeah, live yeah. together. I'd like to see Maul versus Charlemagne on <laughs> on live, Insta live. fam. Please on don't live. just yeah. beef. Oh yeah. my god! I, I but I don't have a beef with Charlemagne. Someone got to take their shirt off and start yelling. He'll probably do that. <laughs> I don't. I don't have a beef with Charlemagne. I don't know why he has a thing with me, but it's okay. I told. I told y'all here. I was like, I respect Charlemagne. He's done a lot, but I just, I just, I just see him for who he is. I know who he is behind all of that. Tell me more about rappers and athletes appearing to be corny now because uh, we have to look at them. It's just a lot of things they're doing on live. It's just like, why are you? You shouldn't be doing that. And I, okay, one person, obviously the biggest figure out there, LeBron. I love LeBron. One of the greatest players ever. Greatest, whoa, whoa. probably the greatest athletes Paul, ever. Paul, that. The biggest figure out there. <laughs> biggest, yeah, he is. Yeah, one of the I most know, popular people on the planet. Yeah, it's true, but you have to pause it. Yeah, it was a reach. Yeah, we don't want to talk about it. It was figure. a little bit of a reach. The biggest, fig- the biggest figure in, out there. Nah, we yeah. want to. figure. Yeah, I'm with you. A stretch before you reach. The Roll. biggest? Okay, pause. I'll, I'll pause it. If that's, I'll pause it. Pause. He said we. He said we all know the biggest figure out there. He said he's, You're not aware. I said he's one of the biggest figures out there. All right, there. don't say. It. All right, just continue. Just continue. I didn't bro. say he has one of the biggest <laughs> figures. That was see. You see how that that just rings different. Yeah, no, that that's that's a pause. That's the pause. If I said that, but no, he's one of the biggest figures. This shit is bald as you make it out to be. No, nah. That's nah, just my corner. I right. thought you were really getting like some George Jefferson shit happening. It's starting at it's starting at the top. My corners are gone, but you, you're forty. You're supposed corners yeah. are supposed to be yeah. gone. Everyone's yeah. corners gone. Nah, I've been. I ain't gonna lie. That, that's how I know this quarantine is getting to me because I've been looking in the mirror like, you know what? I can do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm do not. It. Yeah, don't. I'm <laughs> not gonna do I know. it. I know you're not. But. But you, ah, you start to feel it. I don't feel bad. <laughs> yeah. Listen, I've never been this scruffy either. Never. That's, like, that's, that's that's in though. That's tour shit. I'm here. Yeah, that's that's, that's tour scruff. Yeah. This is a month and change worth of scruff. I mean, you guys, no, three weeks. You guys see the man bun coming in? It's three weeks. You see it coming in? Man bun. Mm. You see it? Or you got to go another two years to get a man bun. All right. Man bun. Man. Right. <laughs> don't do that. Don't do that. I, I don't know where he was going to take the man bun uh, entendre. It, yes, you do, because Rory's dying to sneak done in a verse. <laughs> Without question. It's kind of, I, was, I was leading you there. I was actually thinking about becoming Lil Dunn as like my rap name. Mm. That's where I was leading you, man bun. That's my man done. Uh, <laughs> I was taking it there. Yeah, I see where you're going. Um, I like it. Back to the athletes. But yeah, uh, LeBron. LeBron. He's just one. one LeBron did. Out. LeBron did Richard Jefferson's podcast. No, that's that's fine. Oh, okay. I, I just don't like. I, I clicked on. So LeBron. what do you do? LeBron shouldn't be showing us that he his has family. No, he that he has <laughs> family. That he has sneakers that he hasn't worn. I could guess that LeBron has sneakers. <laughs> I mean, that he hasn't Mom, worn. Don't do that. I'm just saying. Don't it's like that. LeBron is showing us his sneaker collection. He's the biggest figure. Exactly. <laughs> um, which is why he shouldn't be. Sh- I can guess that LeBron has Nikes that he has never worn. Fam, nobody. Everyone's bored at home. Bored. LeBron too. Super. LeBron shouldn't be bored. That big ass house, you can't be bored. Yes, you family. can. Nobody wants to no. be with their family, man. Nobody. That's, that's crazy. Sorry, <laughs> that's crazy. We choose it's careers to be on the road on purpose. Yo, yeah. and listen. Shout out to our Spotify viewership. <laughs> I mean, shout out to our Spotify listenership. Shout out to our YouTube viewership. Uh, shout out to, and this, I want to dedicate this episode to everybody with a balcony. Boy, is it important now, right? Some type of outdoor space. Yeah, one hundred percent. See, I also <laughs> I, no, no, no. We I, should I, dedicate we it to people that don't. States. I also want to dedicate this episode. <laughs> Big up the people that have it. To the people. Yeah, who's, actually, the people that don't. That's have what it. I'm saying. Yeah, dedicate <laughs> to people that don't. Yeah. Oh, fuck you, peasants. All right. <laughs> Come on, Joe. 
<laughs> what? I'm joking. Look I'm at Republican joking. Joe. I'm joking. They should pay back that 1200 <laughs> and tax it. Ah. <laughs> Hello? Yeah. Yo. Fuck you doing? Podcasting. Oh, pardon me. Peace yeah. out. No, no, no. No, stay here for a minute. Is, 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 Come on, man. I don't feel like doing this. <laughs> I don't feel like going through this goofy shit with you. Man. I'm just asking you if you're feeling all right during the quarantine, man. I know men are not used to their, their male friends checking up on them, but how you doing? How's your mental health? I, I'm, I'm well. How about yourself? I'm great, nigga. <laughs> Damn, I'm great, nigga. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Joe is always great. I want all my friends to know that, by the way. You're not always great. Oh, You're talking up. to me. I'm hanging up on you now. Get out of yeah, here. Yeah, yeah, you. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Ah, take that. <laughs> New computer, hang up fast on niggas. <laughs> hey, you just you can't just, get a word hey, out. You just raise your hand over this shit, <laughs> and niggas is gone. <laughs> hang up. I like that. This shit is like what I like that? hanging up on niggas like this. <laughs> yeah. what was that? I, I summon your phone off. Yeah. What <laughs> was that shit when Will Smith was the was Kazam? Will Smith wasn't Kazam. Shaq was Kazam. Shaq was Kazam. Oh Shaq, what was Will Smith? Will Smith was Aladdin. the genie, Aladdin. like last year genie. too. You wasn't oh. rolling with that. You wasn't feeling Joyner Lucas dressed as Will Smith as the genie? <laughs> Yo, y'all like, all right, forget it, man. You ain't like Will as the, as the genie? Did you like Joyner Lucas as Will as, as the, the genie? It's the real question. Yeah. You didn't see the Joyner Lucas video where he dressed up as Will and all the shits? <laughs> I need to be reminded of that. <laughs> it just no, came it out. just came out. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> His face. <laughs> the real time face reaction. <laughs> It's exactly what you think it is. I haven't heard Joyner Lucas's album. I'd like, to, I'd like to get to it. It's a lot of the songs that have been out in video form. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Most of it. Oh, come on, man. Oh, I, I mean, it I, makes sense. That's robbery. I mean, that's, that's streaming albums. That's how like you do that, it. I know, I, know, I, I know that I'm the one that's outdated. Let me be clear on that. I know that I don't know what's cool. So, cool. No, it's not cool. I don't know it's, if it's cool It's cool. It's profitable. Yeah. It's not cool. He's very uh He's he's very he's very meticulous. He he thinks a, a lot about his his art and what he's doing. For sure. I don't know if that's a good or a bad thing. This was strategic in itself by Yeah. You know, Will's but gonna repost he's it. He's very he's he's he 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 these well he thinks about his shit like to the T. For sure. Like I noticed that about But him. did you enjoy this? I agree with you. But did um, you did you enjoy this? I, I, I'll say I enjoy it because he's nobody else is really doing it to this level. Will you ever listen or watch this again? Um, no, but that doesn't mean I don't enjoy it. I don't I don't go back to a lot of shit that I enjoyed for the moment. You guys, but not let's not start. I mean, <laughs> for, right I, here, I appreciate please. it. No, so what? <laughs> that you appreciate something that was so important in in. My back in my radio days with just what to start with. This is not the start. <laughs> Should have brought up Will Smith and Aladdin then. Right. Yeah. It's your fault. Right. We can, it's your fault, radio right. man. We can start with Will. And this ain't radio. It's your, Will, it's your fault, Hot 97 alum. Will was. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I see, what, I see what type of show we're getting today. Uh, no, I'm not mad at starting with Will because Will showed us how to move uh, when everyone's dead in the world. <laughs> that is true. Get yourself a dog and a gun. Did the dog die in that? It did. It became a zombie. Rest in peace, dog. Will bumass was in the world alone doing pull ups. <laughs> <laughs> gotta stay in shape for the zombies. No, you nigga ain't nobody here. The zombies are here. Oh please. You got a gun. I don't mean What nothing. are you doing pull ups for? And I'm, and first of all, first of all, also Will. well also, what's so bad about just getting bit and becoming one of those people, man? Like at some point just give up and become part of that. Listen, I, I, I believe in re- reincarnation, so I sit home and try to guess what I'm coming back as. What do you think it's going to be? A cigarette. Something so stupid. Like a that, cigarette. Like, Tobacco. Like, a, like an ant. Come back I'm as gonna an ant? I'm going to be something so small because I'm so powerful as a human. I'm going to come back as a bumblebee. The genuine disgust on Rory's face. <laughs> I wouldn't be mad at a bumblebee. I would be pissed off if I Bees are important Nah, bumblebee. bees are cool I wouldn't Fuck be mad bees. Bees. Out of everything I could come back as A bumblebee A ant A, ant. a, a roach ant would be worse than roach. roach Nah, roaches be living for a long time That is a good point <laughs> And roaches kind of be chilling We're not starting with this <laughs> <laughs> Alright, come on, Maul 
You know the fucking vibes. What are the vibes? React. What am I reacting to? Party Mobile. King of the North. In your phone. King of the North. Right now. Yeah. Mr. Snow. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I know. You want to be I'm, Mr. Snow. Yeah. <laughs> Informer. You know it's the dead of Mr. Snow, man. I know blame. Is that what he said? No. No. Oh. <laughs> Wait, well, hold up. Don't do that. Informer. You know, say Dead of Me Snow. I forgot the rest. I know. But he definitely said, you know me, Dead of Me Snow. Yeah. And licked the boom, boom down. <laughs> that we know. We got that A part. A classic. Yeah. <laughs> You've been in the house licking the boom, boom down. No. I, I have not been licking the boom, boom down. No, I used the wet wipe first. <laughs> I have not been licking the boom, boom. Yo, my boss, you too cool to lick the boom boom down? No, 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 I'm just saying during the quarantine. Yo, imagine, man. imagine going to eat ass with a wet wipe in your hand yeah. first. Y'all, y'all, my niggas. So I'm gonna just tell y'all, I be bodying the slide down from the tits to the boom boom. Like when it's, when it's time to eat. When it's time to eat, I'm with you. I can't. That slide. It's important. No, it's important. Ooh. It's an important slide. Hey, what? What? This is. What I'm you, sick of this. I'm just saying. I just, I'm sick of I, it. I just like how you kill us for where we start and then where you go to your start. <laughs> no, I'm not starting. No, you started the titties. <laughs> oh, we only started the titties. <laughs> That's a crazy start. I, no, I slide the titties down a, from the titties to the. The what? slide game is important. I slide down like Silk Freak Me is playing. <laughs> Cause tonight, baby. <laughs> I wanna get uh, You put your shoulders into it? Uh, yeah, sure. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> little kiss on the inner thigh. Ooh, oh, oh, oh. Ooh, you know what's coming, mama. <laughs> mama. Joe, Joe think you think you romantic? <laughs> In your mind you can say yo, I'm and, such a romantic word. guy. And freaky for the inner thigh kiss. So we do that in the club. <laughs> like, what are you talking about? <laughs> the inner thigh kiss is really spicy. Like, nah. That's the new handshake. Oh, I didn't hit the drops. <laughs> That's a good to meet you. No, 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 my Drake beef. And the party mobile has arrived. <laughs> Just the mobile has pulled up. Yeah. Party mobile has pulled up. It's here. Parked at the hydrant. It's right here. in your phone. That's right. On all of your DSPs. That mm. it is. How do you feel about it? Give it to me. I like it. Cop the physical? No. Vinyl? Shut up, no. Rory. Cop the physical. <laughs> no, I like it. I like it. I listened to it twice, but I like it so far. Like there it. you have it, the mall deep guy. <laughs> like it. Uh-huh. it just came out. Where, man, else, can't... where else can you get this sort of analysis? It just, it just came out, but I like it. Huh, Gilly? I like it. I like it a lot. That's what you got? Gilly. I like it. <laughs> Shout out to them, by the way. We never bigged them up for uh, their deal. We didn't? I don't think so. Who? Gilly. Oh, and Gilly and, and their, and their uh, bar stool deal? Oh yeah, well, have, we didn't talk about it. I don't think we did. Oh well, salute to Gilly oh, Wallow. We, we was hating. That's That's, that sounds like we was hating because we nah. didn't say anything. Nah, never. That's, <laughs> That's a well, big, nah, big you salute. Know, you know what happened? Uh, it was a few weeks ago where I was uh, saying that it was a few podcasts that I wanted to big up. Uh, oh, when I was talking about how I think the sports dudes are doing it better than some of the rap dudes mm-hmm. at rapping. No, at potting. Okay, at potting and, <laughs> and the media thing. That verse you played last yeah. episode. <laughs> it's, not, it's not getting it done. <laughs> From uh, Chris Prashad. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh well, congratulations to uh to Gillian Wall on their barstool deal. Yeah, for sure. And, and and all the podcasters, man. And shout out to shout out to everybody that's trying to come up with something to do in these times. Shout out to uh, Fendi, D Nice, Boosie, Tory Lanes. Boy, you guys are helpful. You guys are really helpful to me. <clears throat> um. All right, back to this part. That's all you got, man. Why the fuck am I starting with more? For? Come on, <laughs> I'm, done, I'm done with him. <laughs> uh, I like the second half the best for sure. That's when I felt like Party was really getting into his bag. Um, I'm happy that they didn't try to do work part two with the Rihanna record. Like, I think it's a single and will be a big record, but I'm glad they didn't chase shit. I would have liked the Rihanna verse. Of course. They kind of, they kind of, uh, they kind of catfished us with the Rihanna feature. Well, this is my theory, and I have no evidence behind it or was told anything. I think this was just on a hard drive of 40 Rihanna and Party records where she did the hook, and Party was like, yo, let me hold this. This is a really good record. You're not putting anything out. Just yeah. t- tighten up your vocals. If you don't have the time to put a verse, I'll make it happen. I can see it. So I can see it. But I like it a lot. I'm glad they didn't try to redo work. 
and yeah. sell it to us and force it down for us to stream. Yeah. I really like the album. I like the first half. Uh, I actually like the Drake song better in the course of an album than I did as a single. It feels better in the album. It's a better as an al- album cut than it was as a leak or a single or whatever. With, with Touch Me as the follow-up, it felt like it should have been there. Yeah. We needed that at that point in the album like to have a little upbeat joint. Mm. Listen, yes, so fuck all that. Is it better than the Weekends album? Yes, yes, yes. absolutely. It's better yes. than the Weekends album. All right, cool. By a long shot, to me personally. But let's get to the shits. No, no, <laughs> no, 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 and no. We have built this album. We have talked about this album for way too long. For Maul to come in here and say it was cool. It just came out though. We I can't don't care. We can't go into we something that it. just came. Yeah, but we didn't. This is a reaction we, video. We live, reaction we live review. With it for fucking ten hours. <laughs> First listen review. Oh yeah. We had ten hours with it. Well, how did you feel in the 10 hours? Well, I didn't stay up past midnight, so I heard, it this, going, I heard it this morning. Going to bed early? Yeah, so yeah, you literally man. just heard it. I did. Yeah, how, how deep can we go into the album? Mad deep. Yeah. <laughs> well, Let's okay. get into it. Well, fine. Uh, I liked it. I liked the album. <laughs> All right. Where else can you get this type of content All right. in <laughs> That was a deep dive. I said three words and have much more to say. Oh, we're you, fucking you, with you. You come in. Maul comes in with three words and shuts up. So let me yeah. finish what I'm saying. But you're about to say a bunch of bullshit. After don't be so sensitive. I don't think so. Okay, let's hear it. Um, I wasn't blown away, and I wasn't underwhelmed. Like, and that's I think, bullshit. So you're whelmed. Just a regular whelm. I felt like this was safe. Yeah. I felt like he he got back into his party bag and he didn't try to overdo it it was safe um i, I like safe party though me too i'm okay when artists are safe yeah i'm not like i i, I, I love your first three projects when you was making that same sound i'm cool with you staying safe yeah. well, that, well that's what i'm saying safe is cool into it's not like and party is still in that world where he can be safe and it will be accepted well he can experiment with his writing and producing with other artists which i enjoy like, stay safe with your music. <laughs> like, my points about this album are, like, points that I think are typically overlooked. I know I'm about to sound corny, but I love the sequencing of the album. I do. Me too. That uh, that that song, what is it, News? News sounds a whole lot better Yeah. in, in the album. Yeah. I enjoy it more. I'm with Parks. I enjoy the second half a lot more. I felt like that's when he was really about to get in his bag, and then he just ended it. Um, that was Rory's take. He liked the second half. I like yeah, the first half. I like the second. Oh, you like the first half? Yeah. yeah, I agree. I agree with. Uh, I agree with Rory. I thought he was about to really start getting crazy in the second half. I'm not. <laughs> that second half is the type of party I like. I like the slower, melodic, shit talking, toxic party lyrics over those types of sounds. <laughs> same, same. That's that's my type of party. I'm not angry at any. I'm not mad at anybody who who says that they like the Weekend album more. Because, no, it's, it's because how you how how we receive music is different, and that <laughs> weekend album is a cleaner, much more polished, much higher reduced. production value. See, that felt safe to me. His album felt safe. He didn't try shit in a bad way, I guess, but not a or problem. a less less desirable way. To me, I think personally. Starboy he tried more shit. Yeah, I didn't Starboy, love Starboy right? either. I thought that was more, more not experimental, but poppy. Yeah, poppy ish. Yeah, he went back to more weekender. Yeah, I like the weekend's pop though. Me too. I, I do too. I'll say that. I kind of like it when he gets more into his pop bag, unless he's gonna go super duper dirty, like he was on his first mixtapes or whatever. I, I ain't gonna lie. Now that, for me, now that he, we got both of them me, though, he either does one or the other, and he does them no, both well. I, I think Beauty Behind the Madness was the perfect blend of House of Balloon shit and the pop artist we know is the weekend now. Is that the album with all the hits on it? The gray, no. the gray cover. Uh, yeah, I guess what well, did have a lot. Of, yeah, it's a weekend album and it's yeah. mad hits. Well. But now that we got both of them, we can't. We, we, for fun, we were comparing them and saying that they were beefing. And, but you really can't compare the two. Like, it's two totally different sounds. It's two totally different artists. But for fun, we'll pin the albums well, yeah, together. We're, we're Americans, so we pin every yeah, Canadian against they, each other. But the, the, <laughs> the weekend. No, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. No, no, I'm not, I'm, I'm not letting that ride either. In, in rap, we do it all the time and it's safe. In rap, we compare yeah. artists whose music are totally different, yeah. and we pit them against each other every day. What's, yeah, what's an not, example? So I, I fully believe this. <laughs> All right, I was thinking more these days where it's nah. drastically different. Like a Meek doesn't sound like, like Drake. 
I think they're more, sim- Kendrick, more like similar like than Kendrick and, Arati Kendrick and, and, and Meek. <laughs> Kendrick and Drake. Kendrick don't make a at all. They don't. But the, I would put the, them in more in the same category than the, some of the Lils and Meek. Fam, we had a yeah. Meek and Wale conversation for Mad Long. That's true. And they yeah. don't. They're in two. They couldn't be more opposite. That's true. Yeah. Like we do it every yeah, day in I rap. Think, I think, but I think with rap is still a difference though. Tell, because, tell, tell to me. Because I think with with rap, with rap artists, I think all of them come from like strictly rapping, like putting words together, rhyming, flows. Now the music that they make may be different, but like with singing, it's like with what R and B singers, you can't really. Like I don't even think I could say that Weekend is really R and B. That's fair. Like it's I think he's pop. more pop rock. Pop. Like his oh his album sounds like eighties pop rock. No, I love, I love 80s not pop, pop rock. rock. You don't think it's his album sounds pop. like pop rock? It sounds like eighties yeah. pop. Not barely any drums on there's it. There's no guitars. There's no <laughs> drums. Well, not, maybe not this album. I'm talking about his sound though. Yeah. Like his sound is like eighties pop rock. Like well, so, shit, like, even House of Balloons was like. It don't sound like Def Leppard or something Gritty like that. that pop. was pop. 80s pop rock. Yeah, like, it, it. what I'm saying is, it's not like R&B. weird Phil Collins I shit. I think Party is more R&B. Yeah. I like the fact that Party gave, uh, Party, Party, you know, and my beef is, I kind of don't really rock with the first half of the album, but I'm really happy that there's a variation in the songs. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I always like that. I always appreciate that. Like, I like that. Um... The best song on on Party Mobile is better than the best song on the Weekends album to me. Yeah. What's your well, favorite the, song? So the best far? song on the Party the album is, is the best song of the year. Yeah. So far, you saying? Yeah. All right. We got I mean, a Rory, it's, you know, got it's, a Rory hot take. It's early in the year, but yeah, this is this is the best song of the year. Savage Anthem. This is We're Savage Anthem. This, okay. this is part. Sure. This, no, this is Black Cloud. <laughs> Word. <laughs> this is Party Next Doors. I know you were in your bag when you heard that shit. You know what? And this is me. This is my personal thing. If I get one song from an album that it's oh, that's how the uh, nerd record starts, right? Mm-hmm. Um, a lot of them. If I get <laughs> <laughs> so wait, that's your favorite song, Savage Anthem. Hell that's my favorite yeah. song of the year. That is the best song in that album. Okay, by by a long shot. It's a good record. By by, by leaps. And I know bounds. why Joe likes it. He was going crazy. It's a good record. record. You know, Joe likes it because it's Black Cloud. Tell me why <laughs> Joe likes it. Because it's six minutes. Uh, that's it? Yeah, yes. That's, nigga, that's exactly why you love You don't think song. highly of me. And what I do you can't, mean? I, and I, I, I'm, it's every, no surprise every, that you like their song podcast, that's six minutes and 16 seconds. Every podcast, Did you listen to, the, to what he was saying? Maul doesn't no, no, think highly of me. I, no, I, I, I think it's a good record, but I know why Joe likes I it for sure. I can't figure it out. We haven't had Party Get in this bag in a this while. This nigga has seen me at my high moments and low moments. What do you what mean? A, what a disparity but you're between on, but the you're two. On, but you're on here talking about you love the long songs. Like, you love that. Well, you can name more reasons why I love this song. Actually, no. you don't have to. Hold up. Hold up, man. <laughs> Hold up, man. Hold up, god damn it. We pausing after every line, right? <laughs> every fucking line. Rory. Kaylani is going to triple block us. <laughs> See, and that's she why... She unblocked me, I think. Oh, congrats. Hey! Uh, I'm right. hating. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Kay. <laughs> um, listen, and that's why I say that uh, being an artist is like... It's like being in the Marvel universe because, like, you can just hear, you can hear, like, let's say Kalani's shit was like the Daredevil movie, and now the fu- or the Jean Grey movie, and now Party is dropping to reply to the like. This is awesome. Yeah, he it tore is. Kalani ass up. <laughs> oh wait, hold up. Is this about Kalani? Do y'all think Kalani? We love you. Can I just say that and- <laughs> we love we love you and Kalani. We. <laughs> While Party personalized this song, we are not personalizing these lyrics. We are relating to them with the women in our lives, not you. No, you're, you're, we're personalizing it. <laughs> We've said Kaylani's name about eight times already. Kaylani. Because he is talking about Kaylani. Everything is closed and we found the police store. <laughs> <laughs> that was a horrible part. <laughs> No, we're copping them. It's fine. I don't want to keep being the bad podcast to the songstresses. Yeah. Like, 
Is that what we are? Yes. No, we're not. To the we're ones we love. Yes, yes, <laughs> All the good ones. Yes, yes, we are. Well, they, I Thanks think, for unblocking me. Well, I know why Kehlani blocked It's us. me. You just creeping around every concert dick riding. No, 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 no. I, I don't dick ride. I don't do that. Uh, but I know why Kehlani blocked us. Clip too. riding. I don't know. I know why she blocked us. She don't. She doesn't listen to the show. And she Lick heard, the boom, boom down. She heard the word bitch a few times. I'm okay with that. That's why she doesn't, you know... She, she did, she don't understand the context. Yeah, but we talk. let when we say bitch, we don't. It's for like comedic value. Does, yeah, but she doesn't know that. She comedic doesn't listen, value. She doesn't listen to yeah, but you can't think she's gonna feel that way. It's not, yeah. it's not gender specific. I know men no. dude bitches. I actually probably use bitch towards men more than I do women. Yeah, yeah. Um, okay, Lonnie's been trying to get sexy too. Y'all seen the new video? I did. I have. Yeah. <laughs> What's happening? <laughs> That's I how I knew she was. I was unblocked. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I can see this. <laughs> Word. Um, we do all agree that he's referencing, he's talking about Kalani, right? Yes, mm-hmm. I, I think that's apparent. Allegedly, sure. That's a safe. Maybe assumption. a few. I'll, maybe I'll a few that's moments. A safe assumption. Safe yeah. assumption. He could be pulling from a couple relationships. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> why? Why? <you> st- <laughs> <laughs> because this this record is so amazing, man. Like, R&B dudes get to play in a way that rap dudes don't. You are beautifully, this chorus, you are beautifully harmonizing the word breath, which is just sonically an attractive word. <laughs> True. This sounds like you about to just start on the most love, love, lovely journey. <laughs> yeah. He's starting with yeah, love. What a beautiful outro. Word. It's what you're thinking. Don't hold your breath. What's <laughs> happening next, party? Why not? This is awesome. He must really love her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, there goes that. Never mind. Oh, oh my God. I'm not coming back. <laughs> Save your oxygen. Yeah, that's, it's that's, a pandemic. Yeah, you need no, to breathe. That's pretty much what he was saying. Yeah, but I think it needs to be highlighted. Because only in this country do does it look like it's the man that always wants to come back. Or we're waiting, we're begging for, we're begging to come back, we're threatening suicide. Mm. The women keep it so low. Yeah. So for a nigga to just come out, look, ma, don't wait up. <laughs> this is don't over. hold your breath. <laughs> no. This is over. Continue don't, to breathe. Hey, don't wait on my love. He took a sixth grader's insult. Don't hold your breath. <laughs> <laughs> and made that shit beautiful. <laughs> oh, party, you are the man. Uh, and then held the breath. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, this second verse is so disrespectful to, <laughs> no. to hip hop. This is amazing. It really is. All right, Rory, get in your toxic bag. That's the t-shirt right there. Forgive me. Guys, I it think, was just a moment. I think men finally have a caption. <laughs> yes. No, this got Meg Savage the fuck out of here. Chicks, enjoy your little TikTok dance. We have the new Savage shit here. Y'all about to, y'all about to uh, use these captions? Yeah. Who gonna do it first? <laughs> me. <laughs> I was waiting for him to admit it. Listen, forgive me. It just, it just was a it, moment. It was just a moment. Oh, dude, this but is, see, I've I'm said not, that before and got cursed I'm, out. I'm, but I'm you not, haven't sang it. You, ain't, you didn't. No, more might have sang Under it. these more, luscious more, noises. Yeah. No, more was the alto. 40 didn't produce your version. No. Yeah. Man, but I've said yeah. that bar before, and I got, it, I got cursed out. It, it didn't go over that as well. It didn't sound as good. Listen, I'm not replying to any texts of yours. Don't hold your breath. Um, And it was just a moment. It wasn't it wasn't a big thing for me. Don't no, wait. not even don't. <laughs> don't wait on don't my wait on my private text. Don't, the don't second wait, bar, go fuck on, other people, please. Don't wait on my nut from your... Oh, my... See, we don't ever talk about that. Yo, fuck him. <laughs> Be with him. Have a blast. Yes. See, that's what goes back to what we said. I said it's all about the verbs that you use and the nouns. Tr- don't trust no. me to capture the moment. I'm listen. See, I've never used capture. That's what it is. You or gotta moment. Use, you got to use yeah. capture. You <laughs> that's use. what you got to use capture. When, don't trust. Don't and don't trust me. Don't trust to me. capture the moment. 
I'm not. not I'm not gonna make the best of this. No. I'm terrible at photography. Yeah, and, that's, and that's what. The, yeah, whatever yeah, romantic thoughts and plans you have for us. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, no, I'm. I'm not gonna change. No. This is where I am right now. Uh. Oh my. God. Forgive me. It was just a moment, my That's the one. I might tattoo that on my <laughs> neck. You'd be homeless. Sam ain't let you know. <laughs> Go ahead and play. You engage. The next, no, the next bar is the bar, though. Oh, no. Hold up. Maul wrote this bar. Wait. Maul definitely wrote this bar. Listen, in song maker mode, the fact that he put so much space <laughs> between these venomous lyrics... Words. So she could think about this. <laughs> let, it, let it settle. Yeah. Let it settle in. Yeah, yeah, no, no. And then by the time she gathers her thought, he comes back with the other one. Yeah, no, it's true. And why do I need to? <laughs> and what? Is, why do chicks make it a bad thing that this is just a moment? Because oh, that, don't that feels get me too started. much like Life a, is but a always, series of moments, man. Yeah, and moments past. Why we can't just appreciate this moment in time? I have fun when, when I'm with you. You have fun when you're with me. When we part, I'm doing me. You're doing you. When we come back, shit is good. Like, what's wrong with that sometimes? I've been called insensitive when I've said, well, you have fun, right? <laughs> I got that off? Well, define getting it off. It was no, said. No, it, came, it was no, said. No, no, it came no, with a punch. No, 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 no man has no, no, ever no, got no, that no, off. He got the shit smacked out. Yeah, you yeah, can't yeah, just get that off. I mean, he still stood there. Yeah. <laughs> I'm a man up. Ain't no man down. No, nah, he's killing right here. Also, now, after this, everything this is, I just said, crazy. I still be a side dude. No, nah, I, I take it. I I take it deeper than that. I don't. I don't even think that's what he's saying. Uh, I heard number two is your man now. Talk about the cockiest shit in the world. Like, <laughs> hey, replacement me is your dude. Oh no, there was an entendre. Like, yeah, your replacement me is your dude, right? Hey, scream man. Where, where scream are you man. going? Scream man, scream man, scream. You're we fired. know you're who fired. Kyrie Irving is. You're fired. Yeah, what are you doing? <laughs> well, for you're fired then. Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, wait, where am I at? Uh, oh, don't mind me being number two now. I'm not gonna really get into it here because that's a bar. But yo, life is great. Not with you. <laughs> yeah. I had no idea that being number two would be this fun. Sometimes number two is all right. That's what I'm saying. And See, I don't take it like, I don't take it like he's still trying to fuck with her. I take it like, no, oh, no, 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 no. oh, this is amazing. No, I took that as that <laughs> first away one. from you. First one was your second option is now your man now. Right. And I'm <laughs> balling, bitch. <laughs> You think he fucked again? Yeah, it sounds like it. Yeah, it does sound like it. And then, it then went time. right back into the beautiful chorus. Yeah. It's like, I can't believe he even put this second verse in the song. <laughs> I'll, I'll, be, I'll be honest with you. He like, went crazy. You know how many... Th I've done all of that. <laughs> what? Oh, it's coming. <laughs> oh. <laughs> and the second uh, y'all come in here and be honest, we could really kick it about it. I ain't the only one. Clearly, and neither is party. <laughs> There's a scent in this living room. <laughs> you know, I'm, she don't smell that shit. <laughs> For breezing, get rid of it. <laughs> oh, that's that. That's. <laughs> you, you, you see, I fuck a party, but uh, it's only a, only certain niggas can get that off. What? I stood you up. That was my bad. That sounds like you again, Mo. I have never gotten that off. <laughs> that does sound I'm like you still had, I have never. Have you still had her off. jacket in your back? No. Oh, in the I, closet. I, I in the have. closet. In the closet. No, no, no. Yes, you do. Not you in the have, bag. You, you have, well, somewhere in your house. In the closet, yeah. Yeah, because you bump into the girl after the breakup where you call and you're trying to be considerate and you're like, yo, I got this up, still got your, you left. Yeah, I, I keep, keep it in my keep bag. Keep it. Keep it. <laughs> keep what? it. Anything that's mine, keep, throw it away. It doesn't fit. Yeah. <laughs> Ma. <laughs> Yeah, one day we'll analyze that one too. Keep it. Uh, Bitch, you don't own much more clothing than yeah. this. <laughs> I bought you that for a reason. <laughs> you looked cold. 
<laughs> yeah, your coat is in my closet. <laughs> Gotta have different pictures in a coupe. <laughs> it's only two seats usually. So, no, I mean, you have to you, have different. You got to put mad of them in there. Yeah. Uh-oh. Oh, man. <laughs> I have never gotten that off. <laughs> I want to get that off. I know you. It's You've definitely cleaned the living room. Before. You should have stayed a singer. Yeah, but you can't. <laughs> you definitely fucked something in the living room for sure. Cleaned up before a uh, pseudo wifey came by for mm-hmm. sure. Uh, and there were still remnants of the scent in the air, and you were shocked that she didn't smell. She thought you just changed the glade. <laughs> the glade. That's when we just keep smoking the Kush. Hopefully, it drowns it out. O- open every window in yeah, December. That's when, I, that's when I like ten six. <laughs> Definitely. Why? Why are all the windows open? <laughs> it's November. Oh no, nah, I like that fresh air. Yeah. He said, "I know that's fucked up. That's what pimping do." I mean, you know. And then brought it back. Just let him know and, again. And he's not done. <laughs> the third verse might be harsher. Wait, wait. And <laughs> I took it up another octave. <laughs> took it up perfect. another octave. He went to another kid. He <laughs> jumped to a whole other octave. He turned into sweetness from Dr. Pep on the. <laughs> That's a funny nigga, man. Oh wait! He started going crazy. It gets crazy. He started going crazy. Wait, you hear him in the background? No, no, hold your breath, cause I'm never coming back. (laughs) (laughs) No, no. From the other room. No, no. (laughs) The mic was in the other room. He was screaming across the studio. I'm sweating. This song. This song is amazing. Oh. Is there any more I need to get to in yes. this? The third verse. The third Absolutely. verse. Absolutely. It's the ether. Oh, man. Why don't you start washing your dick? Poor Kaylani. <laughs> Sound like she busted him after the 70th girl. <laughs> hey, when they only give you 70, 70 fuck-ups. <laughs> It's always the 71st, every time. I hate when they bust you at the 70th girl and act like, aha, I got you. No, this is bitch number 90. <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? You, yeah, I'm trying to come. I got away with 20 others. Like, yeah. You ain't even get the one I like for yeah, real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I've been clipped her. Yeah. <laughs> no, <that> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Come on. Watch my dick off before I get home. We've all been there. Fam, uh, I don't even want to tell you the nasty ways I've tried to clean my dick before I got home. <laughs> Baby wipes? <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, I ain't going to tell y'all about me tippy-toeing to put my balls in the sink. <laughs> at the, That's at my the plenty. local diner. I'm tippy-toeing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> at the local diner. Yeah, in the little gas station. <laughs> Bobby, let me get the key. <laughs> what? <laughs> Let me, let me get the key poppy. I've gone, I've gone into Dwayne Reed, got the supplies, and went on the side dark alley part of Dwayne Reed and got busy. Long yeah. before you were in games. No, this, long, no, no. The these man, are, man these are old. Many, no, many no, moves ago. War stories. Yeah, man. These are war, war stories. stories. I thought that went without saying. Yeah, yeah. no, it does. It does. Yeah, you sorry. didn't even say I'm that. Sorry, that was bad. old relationship. My bad. <sighs> What's the wildest way you ever cleaned your dick? I just, I was, what? I pulled my pants down next to Dwayne Reed and cleaned my dick with the supplies I bought from Dwayne Reed on Hillside Avenue. Yeah, but yeah, but you know what, man? These kids today, they don't really have, are they going through the smell test? Like that was a thing I, back I, in the day. I, I, Sometimes I went in the house without cleaning my shit just to be armed with, yo, that's what you're doing in case you want to smell my dick. I think now I don't think young young dudes now even have to do that. I think now it's kind of like it, everything is. I think you need to reverse and <laughs> smell <laughs> smell her. Well, yeah, <laughs> that 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 too for sure. Why do you smell like the locker room? <laughs> why you smell like Rudy Gobert's house? I don't know why Rudy like, keep catching why, stray. I was, <laughs> you know what do why? you do? He just got over the coronavirus. You he got to catch a stray. Because every, every, every time I make up these fake scenarios, it's just much funnier with the center to me. <laughs> <laughs> like, why bitches don't be going for the center, really? Oh, no, they be going I see for seven foot five. They do? Yeah. Absolutely. You just don't hear about it. <laughs> but they be there. Fucking a seven footer is insane. <laughs> 
I haven't thought about it. Five thirty, fucking a seven footer. Yeah, they'd be there for sure. Who is fucking the tall niggas? Listen, fam. I ain't gonna lie. I went in atrium one one day. <laughs> see, that's why I don't like when you catch the M- the M- the NBA niggas out and about. You see them a little different. Like I caught JaVel McGee in atrium with something super nice. I my respect level for him. <laughs> <laughs> Shout up to the roof. Forget, forget like, anything that was. Nah. That's JaVel. Uh, nah, that's JaVel right just, there. Just give up all his business on him. No, this was fucking 30 years ago. Oh. So? Was bad long ago. And, say- and, and this wasn't somebody that he was dating. This was, uh, she worked for him. She was like, uh, I don't well, know what I she, mean, I don't know, know what she was. You know what she was. Yeah, I know what she was. You know what she was. We know what she was. Don't do that. Because this, this, is, this was my homework. No, we, Joe, she could have been a really good assistant. We don't know. No, she, you know what she was on. Don't hold your <laughs> <man. laughs> <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Don't wait on my. All right. He is smoking this song. Yo, women want honesty till they get it. No woman wants honesty. Of course not. This might be too honest. I've never met a woman on on this earth that wants honesty. Yeah, you don't want to. Hear they me. say that, but they don't want that. You know, they don't want to know about you washing your dick and to the way they don't. They don't. They don't. <laughs> they don't. And shout out to the ladies listening, man. <laughs> <laughs> we love you. We do love you. They know. I'm sure you. some chicks have done some nasty shit to clean oh their box God. on the way home. Oh my and God. If, and if they tell us. See, that's the and thing. If, and if they tell us, we're not built for it. No, yeah, no. that's what we, I'm we, saying. We're like, we, 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 we nah. breaking this song we, down, we, we but when Kaylani shoot back with her record, word. All right, now. And first of all, men aren't running around saying we want honesty either. Not at like, all. Nah, some nah, sometimes some just tell me what I want to hear. Some niggas are saying that. <laughs> some niggas is, until they get it. Nah, I'm cool. And then they be like, yo, I'm going to kill myself. Yo, if that, if, if that, <laughs> yo, if that lie sound all right, <laughs> I might be on board. Niggas Roll. always want honesty. <laughs> then they get it, like, I'm going to kill myself. Like, why? <laughs> Fam, you just totally be honest with you. Like, why? Now well, that you got it. The truth of the matter is that men, while we act uh, macho machismo around other men, we're not built to take anything from a woman. We're no, not. And no, it's no, just that when really. you didn't think that she got down like that, that's when it stings you. Well, that's how they feel about us. They didn't. No, no, no. The women know no, when they, they have know. a nigga that ain't shit. They know. Yeah, but, no, the, but, but they, they don't want to believe it. They don't want to. Just don't make them look stupid. Don't have it out there on Front Street. Don't have it out there on public forums. I'm not rolling. Uh, that. I'm not rolling. They know it's, when it's they got a nigga that's It's not reality, but the perception is that men do more ain't shit things than women. It's more expected from a man in the perception world. Yeah, which is why I said women, so we build women know when they got to do be more angels than we do men. So when women do shit, it's like, Fuck. <laughs> yeah, when you find out she 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 sucking you, sucking old dude the same way she sucked you, yeah, that shit hurt. <laughs> you like, oh, he get it just like I get it? <laughs> like his knees, you push his knees all the way back too? <laughs> 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 he change it, you change his pamper too? Like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. That shit hurt. <laughs> right, Joe? <laughs> Joe's and, then, and then you came home and kissed me. <laughs> Joe's going through some memories right now. <laughs> That's the only reason why I pulled you in just now because I saw you drifting away. I didn't want you to drift too. He was getting oh, emo real yeah, quick. I had, to, on I had to grab the string. Oh, like, yo, what the <laughs> Wait, Joe was, Joe was holding his breath? <laughs> the was about to drop, <laughs> drop down. the TV like Forrest Gump, man. Like, Fuck, his face was turning yeah. red from holding his breath. Because you know, no, I was going to say something, but I can't never say nothing because people always attribute it to like a real live person in the world. Yeah. Like, no, so fam, I, so we I, over so here talking I'm talking shit and there's real live people. We talking shit. Yeah, yeah but they don't do that to you. That's, that's like, true. Like you can make a joke. And no, 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 no. Niggas, that's not true. Whoa, whoa, that's not true. They fill Sam's mentions and IG comments now. It's super fucking corny. Oh, they found it? Oh, my God. I'm going to get it. It's a, so corny. Yo, yo, I'm, Y'all are the corniest people on the Shit I like people are at Sam in now. It's the corniest shit That shit is Earth. corny. That shit is super corny. Like, fam, I, we're joking on the podcast. Shut up and enjoy the show. I man. am going to take over. Sam's <laughs> listening to and having a blast and laughing. So shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, worse. She ain't even take it like that. So, <laughs> no. She thinks, you, she thinks you're corny. So you framed it that way. <laughs> I'm gonna take over the world when I find a girl that just don't care about the internet. Uh, good so, luck. Good luck with that. I, yeah. am, I am. I'm gonna find one. Good luck. You think I can't? You think it's hard today? No, they're oh, out there. Man, it's almost impossible. They're out there. Yeah, maybe it's almost that, impossible. Maybe you'll have to go to like the deep depths of Russia. See, no, and that's where I think where we, there isn't Wi Fi. That's where I think we have to make a change and be self aware and how jaded we are. Back to my opening statement. I think some of them other women that we maybe don't really speak to or ignore 
or toned down a bit. <laughs> no, I speak to them, but they. The thing is, how. How, nine, they, nine times out of ten you're gonna they're not, inter- 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 they're not internet and like the, the chicks we talk about I attribute most yeah, of uh, me and Rem's healthy relationship to the fact that we don't care about the internet but oh, and that's but that's what that's I'm saying powerful. Yeah, See, that, that's, that's powerful. powerful okay now but how did you meet Rem the internet See, but that's that's the difficult part. When you meet them on meet the internet, meet your wife and then cut the Wi-Fi off. No, no, no. But listen, <laughs> but when you meet them on the internet, they're just gonna assume that you're meeting other women on the internet. But uh, that's such pro- that's such weird logic because yeah. if you meet her out in the world, you still have to go out in the world. No, yes. but that's also, but yes. now you bring it. Now you bring it up. It's true. Trying to bring logic into it. It's, <laughs> yeah. it's, they they think I, emotionally. I, I want to always bring logic like, into yeah, it. Yeah, but women. Like if emotional. I met you on Fifth Avenue, can I never go on Fifth Avenue now? <laughs> yeah, Rory's cooking. Emotionally, no. Rory's cooking. That's Emotionally, I can't. No, 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 no. Logically, you can't. No, I can't. Emotionally? Sex with motions? No. no that's a ba- baseline three. Short, <laughs> yeah. Shortest three on the court. Yeah, no. <laughs> um, yeah, but but it was still money, so you know, yeah, no. yeah, yeah, yeah. high percentage. Shot. I agree with Rory. I do too. But I'm just but saying, I, and I agree with Parks though. That is such a powerful point. OD. It is. Od. It is. I'm jealous of that. Oh no, it's the yeah, most peaceful thing ever when you're not beefing about the internet. Or you have that too. Uh. No. Not as much as I used to, because I've, I've kind of fucked it up. Well, it's fine. You can do it. It's fine. <laughs> no, well, it's not it's as fine. much as it used to, because y'all live together now. So it's yeah, a difference now. and I don't. This podcast has helped to some degree too, because I don't internet the way I used to internet. You can't. I keep my opinions and jokes and all that type of shit here yeah. on this podcast. Like, yeah, me too, I be retweeting the podcast and kind of keep it moving. Mm-hmm. I don't really internet like that. That's kind of what my timeline is too. Which is trash. I used to be a great tweeter, but whatever. <laughs> that was a nice little deep dive, guys. Where mm-hmm. party took us. Oh, oh, by the way, we're not done with this third verse. Yeah, word. <laughs> <laughs> no, go back. Hold on. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> the girl was right. <laughs> oh, my God. She was right. Yeah, the old air horn is back. <laughs> Yo, he if, yo, if he did two more of these on this album, fam, nobody says this. Wait, hold on. Is, hey. this, is this OLS5? Did yo, he take the, it is, he it take is OLS5, the... for sure. Uh, uh, there's some flagrant stuff in OLS5, too. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. <laughs> these are similar records. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Along the same no, line. four, you said some wild A shit. similar sauce. I know I did. Four? No way. Four, you got some bars off that no one on earth could get off in front of no that girl. Way. Four, I had a couple. I, uh, I got bitches lined up. I got an ego, too. It's pretty crazy. <laughs> Whenever you no, ask, it's not. It's it's along these lines. Yeah, nah, no way. What, what was the bar about uh, having hoes? I tell my hoes all about you. <laughs> Fair, you're not getting that line off in front of a girl. Like, yeah, yo, I got mad bitches, but I tell them about you. <laughs> <laughs> to your girl. But that's the truth. <laughs> yeah, but you only oh. got that off in the booth, though. Yeah, you can't get that off in a real argument. I said it in a real argument. Well, that's why it did work out. <laughs> <laughs> that's we why we're saw, here. We saw the film. Yeah, yeah. that's why it did work yeah. out. Yeah, we, we saw that episode. Yeah. <laughs> I don't argue well. I don't. I don't. I don't. I'm, I'm dismissive. I don't. I don't want to talk about what you want to talk about. Well, you, you <laughs> rappers and singers have such a beautiful luxury of be a, being able to do this shit. Like, I can't type this in a text. I can't say this in person. I you can't can, get these you, feelings off. You 100 percent could go home and tell your fiance that bitches are lined up waiting for you. Well, I'm not luck. going to. <laughs> and he, gotta, he gotta go to sleep. I'm not going. He gotta to. go to sleep at some point. <laughs> but why? You Hopefully got, in his own house. That, but, but, that's, but that's not right. I don't think that's fair. And I didn't mean for us to get into this type of therapy talk here. But you you don't want you don't you don't want your partner to assume that you are dope enough to attract other people. Of, of oh, course, she knows Joe, that. just because things are. Then are, act like it. Yeah, but she 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 knows that. But nah, for you to like, say no, that, act like it in the house. God but, damn it. But but see, but hold on. I'm, okay, I'm. But I'm, I could see from some a woman's standpoint or just a human standpoint that if that's what you're thinking about and comparing to me, I'm cool. Like I don't think I should be here. Yeah, wait, hold up. And that and that is my point. Too many times. Oh man, I'm about to expose shit. <laughs> Too yeah. many times. You know, women get in a relationship with a dude and put the dude on the pedestal, right? Always. And, and then, that, that and, happens always. And then when their view they of the lower. dude changes, yeah, you just get lower and lower yeah, on the yeah, pedestal. Yeah, and when you get low enough on that pedestal, the dude be in an, a, a verbally abusive relationship at home. Now you just calling the dude all the time, yeah, piece of shit, fuck nigga, you ugly, you stink, clean up. Like, niggas take abuse. They be like, whoa, 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 whoa. My side bitches appreciate me. Mm-hmm. 
No. Yeah, but now, but no, now, I'm t- listen. But, but now, but hold on. But now, but Joe, what do you want me to do? But now, if she say or not, or the side bitch part threw you off. Women that I am ignoring that are beautiful and have that I would lick the poom poom down. <laughs> Women that I would lick the poom poom okay. down. I have been ignoring, and okay. you are treating me like shit in this house. Let me counter that. Yeah, but so let me why can't that. I say that? All let right, me counter but- that. If she said that. From a dude perspective, of I have all these dudes that say amazing, like all these nice things to me, would treat me so much better, would take me out, all this shit. My response to that would be, they don't really know you. I know you. They know the idea of you. They see you physically, or they see some of your jokes. They uh, they've had a few conversations with you. I have a bid in with you. I know who you really are. I have a hot take here. Go ahead. Women sell themselves on the idea of themselves. And they sell their partner on the idea, too, when they get in a relationship. It ain't who they are. It's the idea of what they could be. That was Steph Curry uh, in, in uh, OKC at the buzzer. Uh, <laughs> Three-quarter court. Listen, all that. Quarter shot. All, no, all of that sounds good. But now when she start talking spicy about the other niggas that's on her line that he could do things you can't. I ain't gonna lie. Women are always gonna win that battle. That's what I'm saying. Like yeah. y'all sitting here getting some flash shit over. I'm, I'm fucking with it. Yeah. You're not. You're not. But now not. when she start talking her spicy shit, because nah, women let me will always be able to DMs. talk spicy to niggas. Always. I'm joking. They women always will win always that be able to talk oh, spicy. Oh yeah, yeah, to for sure. Yeah. Niggas. All right. Look, can I? Can I? Can I reply? But that's to that? because they no. they don't have a filter. We but, have but, a filter. Let me reply to that. Though, okay. Because you're right, but you're wrong. Because the male ego is fragile. Women will always win that game. Mm-hmm. And men have to protect our fragile ego. Mm-hmm. So my disconnect button, my disattach, disassociate, turn it off button is much better than hers always. So when she going to win that game, I'm off it now. It can't harm me. It's not going to fail. You can have a blast. And that's when women normally, some women, some women, some women, some women, square space, square space, square space women. Some women, 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 that's when some women notice that you've cut your, your button on, your disconnect button, and they just go fuck a whole bunch of niggas because now they start, they fishing for a reaction from you. Mm-hmm. I think I win that. If you go fuck 10 niggas and I'm just chilling. <laughs> You only win. I win. Yeah, but you the man the the male only wins that if she goes and fucks a bunch of other niggas and don't really land one of them niggas. But now if she goes and fucks a bunch of niggas more, and finds more, happiness more, 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 and all this other more, shit, more, more, you more, lose. More, the mo- the more. moment it becomes a Everybody contest. Shut up. More. <laughs> this is not more. healthy. You just unearthed one of the biggest secrets that women don't know. No, they know. They never land them. No, that's not true. <laughs> We're not. Fam, there ain't many that's landed. No, some have landed. Some. Some. It's not all. The percentage is that That percentage is low. When they land, land, they land. I was about to say something to totally disprove that, but it would offend some people out there, so I won't. I'm just saying. Sometimes they hit that Russ Wilson. Who lands? Sierra (laughs) landed. Sierra landed. She landed. She deserved to land. (laughs) And Future cannot sleep well. Time out. out. Wait, he has not had a good night's rest since she landed. Well, well, he he has some emotional issues. Yeah, but but she landed is all I'm saying. He needs needs to remix the Future. But but wait, Sierra landed. Yeah, but on the flip flip side, I can argue that Russell landed too. Oh well, well, uh, he didn't look happy with that white girl. He they like they she, landed. He looked like she, they was holding, she was holding him hostage. They landed. Yeah. But he looks in the like context he likes of what we're talking about. Ideal relationship in the context of what we're talking about. The percentage landed. is low. Yeah. I agree. Yeah, Sierra landed. Yeah, she landed. She landed. They don't be landing. It's okay. mad uncommon to land. But, they when, go, but when they do, they take the trips, <clears throat> they fuck, and they get now laters. Because well, a lot of everyone wants to fuck. And wants now laters. <laughs> that is true. Now or later, you are want good. now later. Yes, you do. Sure. Yes, yeah. you do. Come yeah. on, yeah. especially during the pandemic. And, uh... <laughs> <laughs>I went home. Here comes an overshare. I, yeah, 100%. Yeah. One, I'm, I'm 100%. Yeah. I, went, I went home. Joe, one, is, Joe is Mr. TMI. I went, I went home one night. I've always been that, too. Yeah, yeah Mr. Yeah. TMI. Yeah. If drama's Mr. Thanksgiving, you're Mr. TMI. <laughs>
All right, what's the opposite? Can can we get an opposite acronym for y'all <laughs> when you just don't <laughs> I say think anything? I, share, I think I share a lot. <laughs> oh, DSA. There we go. Don't say anything. <laughs> I'm, 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 T- I'm TMI. Y'all's DSA. Y'all, 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 DSA. For yeah. sure. I'm DSA president. <laughs> Proud. Rory's GAL. Give a little. Give a little. Rory, Rory, Rory's gal. <laughs> okay. Uh, listen, I went home one night from Perfections, and my, my significant other at the time told me that she was cool with the owner and, he, and the owner sent her the video. Oh, that's Dirty Mac and at his finest. Ooh, sent her super. the video of me getting my dick sucked in the back room. That's crazy. What type of nigga is he? That's, what I'm that's crazy. Fan. fan, the game is the game. Oh my God. That's a dirty the, game. Yeah. No, we, you were supposed to jump that nigga though. No, she protected his identity. No, well, we would have figured it out. He's the only old white guy at Perfections. <laughs> Well, I didn't care. I wanted, to, I wanted to continue getting my dick sucked by this chick. Yeah, but like for him, great, great that, she was good at it. Great that you mad and getting yourself out the picture now. Send the video. <laughs> what type of nigga is that? That's no, crazy. For real? He's, he's a super clown. More. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Send the, the, clown vi- that's the crazy. video. That's crazy. Now you telling her lot, is one thing. Uh, nah, a lot of men are super clowns. Yo, that's... and and by the way, that means he watched the video and took the timestamps down and then rewatched it with her. Or no, he's a clown. Wherever he is, I hope he's a. I hope he has COVID-19. <laughs> Whatever it is. I gave All you right, hope. So speaking, you did the hoping. Fam. All right. Hot I'm, take, hot I'm, take, hot I'm, take, hot take. Oh. Did, dun, 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 dun. oh, that's breaking news. Did Party just get Future's entire toxic career out with one record? I don't think Future holds a candle to anything of this magnitude when it comes to toxicity. Nah, Future's pretty good, man. I Better never, than this? I never, never thought, I never thought the Future was the toxic king, to be honest with you. He's been, he's been given the crown. By the young kids. Yeah. I don't, but, I, 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 I don't think he's the king of that. Yeah, I don't, but I don't even think don't it's along that. the same line. I think Future's more... Future masks pain. Yeah. No, he... So, so he, we joke. He, he cries about his addictions and we dance and just ignore him. Yeah, but he, and he still paints himself <clears throat> to be the man to the chicks. But well, collections off. Once I hit you, once you part of my collection. That record was pretty toxic. One of probably my favorite future record. Not if, but I don't think it holds. I don't think any of but future's this, toxic this shit holds. Different, though. Yo, all of us could be toxic to the girl that we don't care about. But when you future's not giving that bar to, like, Sierra landed one. <laughs> <laughs> like, like that's what I'm saying. The girl, you you have to be able to be toxic to the person that you love for me to really call you toxic. Like Chris, you. Chris Brown to me would be like one of the toxic kings. He's up there, yeah. Because he's coming to the club when Karuchi's there with a nigga. I'm here, my nigga. <laughs> like, what are you doing? I told yeah. you I was coming. You're pretty high on the list too, bro. He'll make a song and title it K, <laughs> and then blame her for everything, <laughs> and then scream her name, Karuchi. And yeah. then it's song like, yeah. like he, yeah, no, he's up that's, there. I need my toxic to be for real. Not, out, out in the open. I'm no fucking in Gucci flip flop. Nigga, you are crying inside. <laughs> I don't, I don't believe you fucking a okay. bitch that you don't really want to fuck. That's a good segue. Cause I wanted to ask you, let's shoot Kaylani some bail here. Is party just the hurt dude that is now making up things to make himself feel better? Not in 2020. No, nah, I don't he's think hurt, that. Though. He's hurt. You don't Kyrie think don't even wear number some... two. Anymore. I, I, yeah, I you don't, don't make this record out some hurt. Well, that, well, that's why I'm saying not in 2020. I don't think so. I think that. Because this could, all right, this, as, as this, much as we bigging this up, this could be a diary of a really hurt man. Absolutely. Trying to make himself hurt, feel better. This is a hurt song. I don't, but, but. That's where the good toxicity comes from. Of though. course. But I don't take it as him. Like, I don't, he's, I don't think he's shitting on her. On this record, I think he's just being brutally. Excuse me? Honest. What do you think he's doing? No, no, no. Uplifting think, her? No, no, no. I don't think, no. <laughs> Empowering her? No, 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 no. I think he gave that, her hope. I think that he's just being. Brutally, he was the hope. He's being brutally honest. I think is what he's doing. She just started open. Like he's owning his shit. He's owning what he did. He's like, yeah, your girl was right. Like, I got my dick. This, up. All right, this yeah. could also be viewed as. If you're breaking up with a chick and then yeah, she get upset and be like, "Yeah, that's why I fucked all your friends. That's why I fucked this dude." Like that, this could be viewed as the male version of this. I'm just trying to give the other I other know. side. I don't know again. No, that's what I'm saying. This is just him saying. The parallel here? This is him just saying. You're right. I fucked it up between us. To me, this is what this is. He's, he's telling accountability. He's telling yeah. This is like his accountability. I, I want right to challenge that though. You want to challenge want, his accountability? Yeah. Th- this is why? well. I don't know. If this is accountability. It's I'm just saying what happened. That doesn't mean that accountability because. Oh, all right, slow down, Joe. <laughs> slow down. Don't hold your breath. Thoughts racing. <laughs> Thoughts. This is really Joe's bag. Like, Thoughts OD. racing. 
His mind's flooded right now. It is. <laughs> I'm challenging that, Maul, because men are often called fuck-ups for not adhering, adhering to rules before it's time to implement rules. Okay. Or rules that they never agreed we to never, that you already came in a relationship with. About, yo, in verse one and two, I take from this, he's telling me, we just rock, we just rocking right now. He ain't saying this is leading up to something. He ain't saying we both have the same expectations. He's saying this is the moment we having a blast. Damn girls be hitting no, the Joe, this, this first verse is after the breakup. But li- no, but listen to what he's saying, he's, Joe. He's saying, forgive me. It was just a moment. I'm a man up. Ain't no man down. Like, I'm a man up. I'm going to take onus. I'm going to take accountability but for that's, what I did. But that's just being a real no, nigga. No, well, first of all, no, no. forgive that- me it was just a moment was not a good thing. He was telling her, no, yo, you was of, just a moment. Fuck out of here. this is a good thing. I'm just saying he's taking accountability. <laughs> but what I'm saying is accountability don't mean that he want her back. He made that clear. No, I'm, I'm not saying he wants her back. I'm not saying that. I'm not saying I'm just saying this is an accountability record. We're just saying that we think when Future gets into this bag. It's coming from he's hurt, but he's trying to dance through the pain. He's trying to numb the pain with with vices. And but Rory like was that. suggesting this song is coming from her too, which I agree with. Yeah, I'm I'm just trying to give the other side that I, that, I, that, I, that I think the the woman could I make like a case. Com- I like or Kaylani toxic. or whoever. Like this yeah, is, this is a hurt man. Right, this now. is confident hurt. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like I, I don't know. I, if I, he's, I, I want to hear. Yeah, actually, uh, I, don't yeah, know. Nah, I don't know. if he's. I don't, I don't know if he's confident. I don't know if he's confident. I don't know if he's hurt. I want to hear get your shit off hurt. Then I don't know if he's hurt. I think he's taking accountability. Like you know what you I did. Fuck. You don't up. sound hurt to me, but yeah, I don't think this is hurt. No, he's taking uh, accountability. My um my parallel there was when women start saying things when they're hurt to hurt you. Like I fucked this person. Yo, I've been cheating on you. Like just even women, if they didn't. Women get shit off. Not the this could be the case. Women. No, no, no. <laughs> square face women we're, do that too. We're talking about though. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Every type of woman does that. Where they just say shit when Roy's, they're hurt. Rory's typecasting. <laughs> to to a whole gender. Yes, I am. <laughs> um, yes, this could be viewed that way too. I'm just saying a bunch of shit because I'm hurt. Nah, this is a account. What can a record. woman say to hurt me after I don't care anymore? I see why them niggas laugh at you. <laughs> she say that you ready to go shoot? Me you too. Ready, you ready to air the whole block out if your girl black? Not I see at why the, them not niggas at, not at this point in my life. Yeah, nah. Get the fuck out of here! If your girl tell you, I see why them niggas be laughing at you. You yeah. going to air the whole block today? Yes, at forty. No way, more. Okay, no way. Now, thirty-two year old Joe, thirty-three year old Joe, thirty-four and thirty-five year old Joe, thirty-six year old Joe, thirty-seven year old Joe, thirty-eight year old Joe, thirty-nine year old, thirty-nine and a half, thirty. Right before your fortieth, you're right, airing the right block now. Out. Can I? T- what nigga said it? Who? Who be laughing? You gonna have? You gonna have soul pull right nah, up and slow down? You know the one that used to do it for me. It's gotten me on multiple occasions. The and this is I'm sure every guy is going through this. The you're, you're, that's why your niggas be trying to holler on the low. Yeah. Oh yeah. That, that one is that one is that it, line is so it, tired. It, yeah. yeah, but that back, shit is but back so in tired. the day when but when you when you didn't know it was a line and you like Who? <laughs> 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 yeah. Who was it? <laughs> like, I know who it was. It was Eric, right? <laughs> just give, just give me the first line of his name. Oh, it was Eric, right? Eric, <laughs> just the Eric, first line. He's back. <laughs> <laughs> that that one used to get me a little bit. Yeah. But I don't I don't think none of that exists today. No. I don't think. But no, listen. Words wise, I'm not Let me let me circle back here to uh listen. This nigga was going through it when he was super in love and now she's leaving you for fucking Kyrie after he signs his Supermax and he just won a championship. You're hurt. You're hurt. That hurts. Somewhere in there it hurts. That one hurts a little bit. Yeah. Because it seemed like like her and Kyrie was like, and we don't know that this is about them. This is hypothetical. Kalani, we love you. But yes. they was like, like they looked like they liked each other for real. <laughs> this nigga was on suicide watch. <laughs> Yeah, and that no, is, no, and, no, that, no, and no. that is not, uh, and if I'm not taking shots at mental health, <laughs> of course, um, to that point and not to them personally, it don't really be the money or the status of the next dude. I used to feel a way like when I could tell they liked each other, <laughs> like oh y'all really are into really each, other. each other, Dave. like you guys have chemistry, <laughs> See, like the- your, my text will not be replied to. <laughs> See, I'm the opposite. I love that part. No, not if you still like her, I'm saying. The opposite of trying oh, to get no, rid of no, her. No, 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 If I want to get rid of her, thank go- oh, thank God you found someone to get you off me. For but, sure. But that 
I feel like this fam, is what this is. Fam, that was what fam, this is for him. When you look like you really like him, I'm at home like I'm keeping tabs on the month. Yeah, you're supposed to. It's that time. Yeah, y'all still <laughs> eating, eating, eating cotton candy together. See what happens at month eight. Yeah, oh, yeah. Month, month eight. eight. What? Eight. 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 Not even eight weeks. <laughs> These bitches don't get to month four. They be pregnant mm. at month eight. Mo, come on. Who you be talking to? What? You don't nah, think chicks sometimes get- <laughs> they have the bounce back pregnancy, the clap back pregnancy. You don't think chicks be pregnant eight months into knowing a nigga? Oh, no. I mean, On the rebound? One, one, I, one day into I, I think, oh, sure. I, but, I, think, I think chicks be pregnant uh, one month into knowing a dude. On the I've rebound. Seen I've seen it. For sure. Yeah, I, I've, I've seen I've, it for sure. I've seen it. Now you're at the abortion clinic looking stupid. I mean, do you look stupid? Or do you look smart? You look stupid. It's her choice. Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> Try to, try to paint you in that corner. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Just say yes, Joe. No, no, yes. Yeah, 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 that's yeah, her yeah, choice. Yeah. No, 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 Roy, you, Roy likes to do that. Yeah. yeah. That's, that's my favorite thing on the pod. Right. No, you, no, you handle it gracefully. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, did y'all see the Kalani video? No. no, I'm still blocked. I saw the one with Tiana Taylor. She, she, she up there shaking that ass. She is hurt. I, we don't know that, Joe. <laughs> Shit. Every time a girl shakes their ass, they hurt. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like the chick that are. That's that, not true. Yes, it is. No, that's a. That's, that's a, not true. There's some truth yes, in it. Is. A, a, a lot of times when a girl Guys, is getting butt ass, hey, when she's we're here, hurt. she's hurt. I. She's masking it. Look, and I'm, t- I'm telling my girls like, oh, all right, come on. In. <laughs> Look, she ain't never did this before. You know what my favorite. Yes, you know what my favorite thing is. What video did she do this? A nigga, her and Tiana Taylor was in a fucking. That's pool. what I was. Yeah, that's what that, I was just talking about. That was last month. No, it wasn't. It was a while ago. That, no, it, it was, was last not month. a while ago. That was not a while ago. It just, wasn't last month. It, it was, was definitely last month. You don't month. have to be literal semantics, man. You know what I mean? That was recently. No, I think it, it was, was an, last it was, month. <laughs> they shot the video last month. Yeah, I don't think that's semantics, man. <laughs> I, I think it was last, last month. month. But whatever. Well, they but shot she, it two months but, ago. But Kaylani, but Kaylani, she's always been, she's always tapped into her sex appeal, though. When? Always. When? Uh, oh, for a while, for years. Past, past Two years, I would say she's she's gotten she's into this. it. I mean, she really? went from like the baggy clothes she tomboy just shit her to hand over a pussy. I've never seen that. Look, look at this. Look at this. I've never seen this. Y'all talking about something different? What's I mean? Kalani's a so? sexy girl. She, she is, she, she and is she's always been sexy. I ain't never seen this. I don't know. If you I always so? felt that way about Kalani though. I remember you shitting on Kalani a few years ago. No. Yes. No way. Yes. No way. Absolutely. No way. I can tell you when. When. When I said she was attractive and you was like, no, she's not. When I said she was sexy, you said, no, she's not. All right, well, Joe getting blocked again. <laughs> <laughs> we've had this talk. This is why well, you saying this, Joe. We, we didn't have to no, have this we've talk had this on the talk. podcast. I'm just saying, we had this talk before, and that's why I'm like, wait, you never felt this way about her before. Yo, Fab, man, I loved your album. The DJ. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just being honest. I love doing the tracks you with you. You can't album, say bro. that now when you shit. Mom, like, shit it on me. Yeah. Mom, okay. Mom, mom, mom. Right, no, 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 let me shoot on. you some bail. Kaylani started out very young, and chicks start out in their tomboy phase when they're younger. No, this When they're was, teenagers, well, then try? they start to find no, themselves me, as a woman, well, and that's what she's doing no, now. Mom, this was, this I, was I, after that. I am not attracted to Kaylani. I didn't say you were. But Kaylani is attractive. But I'm just saying, we had that same talk, and that's not what you said is all I'm saying. I cannot remember that okay. talk, and you are Puff Daddy with the remixes, no. so I'm not acknowledging <laughs> no. that. No, there's not no but remix. I, I'm is, telling you what they, you said. All right, that don't cement it in stone for me that you're saying that. Okay. But Kaylani's attractive, and she's always been attractive. Okay. This is different, though. Yeah. She's getting older, man. My director name, Hyphy Williams, toxic. Hyphy Williams? She's from the Bay. Yeah, uh, that's clever. It was. Oh, she, her director. And she's name. quarantining, so I she's know. doing her own thing. I like it. No, no, that's fine. Toxic quarantine down. Home videos down. Toxic challenge going up. Social distancing. Got y'all in the house busting this shit too. You know, I like it. I'm I'm in support of this, regardless of what Maul says. And I like this record a lot. <laughs> what you mean, regard? I ain't even say nothing. I want Kaylani to reply. Me too. And she I will. think she's the she's one that to. would reply Cause, cause, really well. Because yeah. that might learn them. That might learn them something. And Ke- Kehlani will not protect feelings. She would be the best to reply to that type of record. Because when a chick is over you, like she's she gonna bar you up. Yeah, yeah, it's true. It's <laughs> yeah. True. Listen, we have other shit to talk about. And so oh yeah, I, I, she'll this, start. She, and Kehlani will dig deep into his insecurities. She'll yeah. know what will trigger him. Yeah. That response might be. Yeah, crazy. That's where they always go. Yeah. They always go to the insecurities. I'm, yeah. I'm, I want to keep Kehlani. She might like tackle his relationship, like with his father. <laughs> She I'm might like, dig deep. Let's keep Kaylani covered. Something, something from his childhood that covered in prayer. He said in okay in privacy and intimacy to her. 
For real, because between her recent her recent experience that we won't talk about with Homeboy and now Party coming out shooting shots. Let me tell you something. When an artist drop a song about you and the lyrics start like this, it does ru- affect the day. <laughs> it does. Yeah. Trust me, I know. I did find it interesting when he, uh, I think it was on the Rihanna record when he, maybe it was the Rihanna record. He said something about her having better PR or her, have, her having a better publicist in the breakup. Mm-hmm. That's true. And and then decided to make Savage Anthem. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, word. <laughs> PR your way out of this one. Yeah, no, it's true. <laughs> Listen, shout out to Kaylani. Shout out to Party. Shout out to everybody, man. What a song. What? what hey, a I song. gotta, I gotta, I can't wait to like really listen to this this week over the weekend. Yeah. This album. And I'm glad Kaylani's still in album mode because I think this just gave her a spark. For sure. Oh, no, she has. Oh, yeah, no, she, no, she had. <laughs> the, she had the record done already. She, she was waiting for this. It's coming. The record was done already. She's just like, all right, put that on the album too. <laughs> I can't wait to cop the Kaylani, Kaylani single. Park the car. <laughs> Park this nigga. Park the car. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that was ninety minutes of party. Yeah, let's get to the, <laughs> let's get to the real king of the north. Mm. Real king, mm. Jesse Reyes. She dropped some fire. It's fire. Listen, man. It's fire. It's fire. That, shit was black. that album is really good. That shit with black is my shit. I, I was I was surprised. I, I will say that. Why? I've liked to. I like her music. We like, we like Jesse Ray. Of course, yeah. but I didn't. I didn't like her like this. <laughs> well, we had never heard like a full. Y- yeah, like I liked some Lucy's here and there. I have, a few I have joints. Lucy's in my phone from Jesse. Yeah, you're right. You're I didn't right. like it like you're this. Right. Is right. what I'm saying. I liked. Right. I've always liked the first liked full project where we. You're right. Can yeah. get Jesse is is, is what he's saying. Nah, I, I, I fuck like, with this. I project. like the artwork. I like the theme. <laughs> I like the title. Yeah, this, this was a good album. <laughs> yeah. Gave it one listen, but I want to give it more to give a proper breakdown. But that first listen, man, it's a good project. Real, real good project. Very good. Uh, who else put something out? Uh, Alchemist and uh, Conway got something coming. They put out one record with Schoolboy. I, search, I searched mm-hmm. all night for that shit. I thought it was coming out yesterday. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I thought it was only the, I think only the, uh, I didn't, I didn't the record. I, I searched again this School morning, and it was, it was just the Schoolboy record that was up there. That sounds ridiculous. It sounds crazy. That, yeah. That sounds crazy, though. <laughs> it sounds... That's gonna be insanity. Jeezy put out a EP. Did he? Oh, I didn't even yeah. see that. It was Shorty Red. I didn't hear. How was it? It's pretty solid. Yeah. It's good to hear them back working together. Tank put out an EP too. Did and I, I know I'm the only one that reports on the Tank drops. I love Tank. <laughs> I love. I really. I I love Tank. But Tank, tank is, is dope. It's, tank, it's, you can't tank. love R and B and not fuck with Tank. Yeah. Tank is is like hit or miss for me. More hit than miss for me because I just like the sound of his voice. But this this EP was all all pianos, all piano. Oh, it might be my all bag. Him, oh, nice. All him singing oh, I definitely on the have piano. To check that drums? Out no drum. Not a not, oh, wow. a not a drum in sight. So it's a it's ballad. Five, the whole album's a ballad. It's five songs. Oh, okay. Over nothing but a piano, and that's my that's my thing with Tank. I'm not gonna get into a Tank deep dive here, but Tank either goes too adult or too young for me. Mm. Let me see what Tank. And I about. normally like when he. Goes younger a bit, like his adult because he's uh, so much older than me. Well, let me not even say that. How old is Tank? I'm not even sure. Not that old. Forty five. Oh, Sean. Uh, Sean Stockman's on it too, or is that the that's the one you was talking about that Scream Man just pulled up? I doubt it. Sean Stockman's not on the CP. He was on okay. his last. He album. just put out a, a record too. That's good. Like probably two weeks ago. Sean Stockman has been smoking shit on the low. Yeah, no, he put out a, a really good record. Ever two, since, two or three weeks ago, he put ever, it out. Ever since I made my visions of, of a sunset joke, he, <laughs> he, he has been smoking shit. Tearing shit, shit up. Yeah, he's not playing out here. Yeah, I, he's, I got, he's got some artists under him too that are dope. Yeah, shout out to Tank, man. Uh, cool EP, cool EP. Um, Javon, am I pronouncing that correctly? Uh, he was a singer on Chicago Freestyle. Erickson, you be in the know. Oh, I, I, G, Gvion, Javon... I'm Junior. white, guys. Pardon me. Um, <laughs> yeah. Gasp. <laughs> Some people don't watch YouTube. <laughs> um, uh, really, really good album. He's the singer on Drake's Chicago Freestyle. Um, suggest you check that out as well. Still got yeah. cooks, man. No project. Shout out to Simon. Man. Well, your rap name would be Phenomenon. No, it would not. <laughs> yes, it would. No, it would not. Well, it depends what he yes, picked it. Yes, it would. In the Maul early would 90s, Maul would have picked that, that, that's, that's And that's what I'm saying. Maul would have picked his rap name <laughs> when yeah. Fab picked his, mm-hmm. when Conceited picked his. When so I would have went with Phenomenon. Hold on. Conceited, Conceited and Fab did not pick their names at the same time. <laughs> 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 what are you talking about, Phenomenon? I think they both picked their names in the era where 
street, flossy, dressy niggas can pick the the <laughs> that I, type of name. And like, I would have went phenomenon. Uh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> that sounds like a male stripper, but what's wrong with you? Phenomenon. <laughs> would never pick that name. Have you ever been a, well not, not you. Have y'all ever been in a relationship with a girl that likes male strippers? Do y'all judge that person? Girls don't really like male strippers. Uh, yeah, every chick that I've ever dealt with thinks male strippers are disgusting. Yeah, they don't really like them, for real. If the convo It's a fun up. idea. Like, <laughs> Does Dwight Howard count? As a male stripper? All right. All right, forget it. We have things to get to. <laughs> <laughs> um, you always go back to the Dwight center. Howard always count? back to the center. <laughs> <laughs> does Dwight Howard count? <laughs> <laughs> we know what he does for a living. <laughs> do, do we though? Come on, we're not doing that. Yes. Multiple streams of income. He you gotta diversify. So, so y'all think that Dwight Howard moonlights is listen, a male listen. stripper? Listen, more athletes think, have to decide life that, after athletics. Like, I think Dwight Howard moonlights. As a, I'm as I finished what I asked you. As a male stripper, as worse. Okay. Well. <laughs> I, I have a much worse take on Dwight Howard than that. Okay, well, if, if that's, uh, no, that's no, 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 that's, that's not where I know. I didn't want to go there. No, 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 no. I didn't, I didn't want to do that's that. That's the least no, yeah, of what no, I think no. about Dwight Howard shenanigans. No, 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 no. I don't want to go into it's it. Not very, hey, it's not it, very progressive, Joe. it ain't just me. I just don't, yeah, I know. I just don't want to go into it. You know, too. No, no, I, I don't want to go into it. I'm just saying I don't, don't want to Don't egg us on. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me ask you all quickly and we'll get out of this. Dwight Howard, man. How many of y'all I can't do that? Yes, you can. <laughs> I'm kidding. And shout out to Dwight. Because <laughs> I'm kidding. Whatever, whatever he's uh, allegedly accused of, you don't think a lot of your favorite athletes and rappers do the same thing? I, I know they do. Okay. I, I, I talk to a lot hard, of women. More going to be heartbroken when his favorite rappers finally come out. Why? Why am I going to be heartbroken? I don't subscribe to none of these niggas away from the, the booth. <laughs> I don't care what these niggas do away, away from, from the booth. Yeah, like, they're yes, not my not. heroes. Yes, you do. No, I do not. Yes, you do. No, I you don't. Take, you're going to take those raps a little differently. Anyways, uh, Parks put us on to some, some shit when, oh, we, yeah, when uh, we were waiting to nah, record. I'm, nah, I'm not true. I've been peeped. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> Yo, you just on him now? Yeah. <laughs> Stove God Cooks. I guess he signed to uh, Buster Rhymes. <laughs> Rock Marcy did his whole album. Now, Parks said, yo, I got some shit. We sat down and listened to the whole thing yeah. without a skip. Word. That shit is fire. Reasonable drought is the um. <laughs> that, that shit is hard. <laughs> and he's funny as fuck. Yeah. Fam, his name is Stove God <laughs> Cooks. What a great name. And what a great project title. Yeah. Word. And Rock Marcy's involved. I'm excited. Great. Awesome. Yeah, no, this was hard. Yeah, Park put this yeah, on. It sounded good. No, he was the two uh, joints that I heard sounded good. I was hype when I put that shit. I put it on after party last night. I'm making ugly faces on the couch. Like, no, oh wait, I'm not ready this, for this, this right now. This, this shit was great. <laughs> yeah, this is something I could have seen you bringing in here more. Yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm gonna definitely shit. listen to it. That shit is awesome. uh, Shout out to Upstate, man. Upstate is killing shit. Yeah, that's dope. I didn't know he was from Syracuse, man. My Oops. young boy Che Crew put a uh, project out last night too. Who's that? Okay, Che Crew. I played, familiar. I played a couple sleep, of joints. My on sleeper here. today. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. I played a couple of joints off his yeah, project. Nah, he sent me that like a month ago. <laughs> oh, you been peeped. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that fan so much. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What? Yeah. Oh, oh, that's uh, old. Oh, you on that now? Oh no, I just I discovered him in Houston. <laughs> but that's not you. you don't know. No, that's not me. That's, no, that's I'm no, 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 no. <laughs> I'm the person that puts people on to music. Marks, thank you. <laughs> How is that me? Because you be peeping. Oh, no, I do, and I put people on to it. I'm not the one that the gets generosity. mad when when artists oh, like try to become, hoard. Yeah, you don't I hate try to when, hoard artists. when fans oh, get mad like worst. now he's popular. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. no, nah, that's the point. Yeah, I want people. No, to you'll, hear this. you'll share it. That's my you'll, shit. You'll share it. Yeah, we'll share. Music lovers. No, I'm never. I'm never that. That. No, once he's mainstream, I hate him. Right. <laughs> Yo, he could have ended right at Stove God and it would have been hard, but <laughs> Cooks makes it. Like, you have to say it. Like, it don't allow you to form an opinion because my name says that I'm about to cook. <laughs> I like right. Reasonable Drought. I like that. No, he yeah, cooked. Shout, shout out to him. Shout out to everybody involved with this project. Uh, all right, come on. 90 minutes in and we get to the beat battle. Yeah, it's crazy. Word. That's crazy. It's going to be a four-hour so week. It was a good week for music. Yeah, it was. Who y'all got? Well, Tim. which well, we let's start tell, with? Let's tell the people what happened. Timberland, Timberland, legendary Virginia icon, uh, agreed to do a one-hour battle with Swiss Beats, legendary New York icon, Bronx icon. Uh, They're both world icons. The, the, these two, man, this was this was incredible. I think this happened the night that we recorded a podcast. It was, it it was it Tuesday did. night. Yeah. Like, I went home, and they had this cooking for me, again, at my peak boredom. 
Like <laughs> I'm like I have to highlight that because some of these people on Insta Live, like niggas, is really giving giving you something that to entertain you during this quarantine. Mm-hmm. Creators, creators gonna find a way to uh, create a one, new lane. One hundred percent. And utilize you know the platforms. This is uh this is fun to watch though. Like this is, you know, I I sat and looked at this and you start thinking about a lot of artists that are no longer here that you would have loved to see do this type of thing. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Hear these type of conversations and um. Yeah, this was dope, man. This was this is definitely fun to watch. It's uh, you know, it's competitive, but it's also you can see the camaraderie. That's, that's one of my favorite parts. Yeah, that's one of my favorite parts of yeah. It's of competitive, this whole but thing. you can yeah, tell yeah. it's not personal. It's, no, they're actual. They're fans. having these, fun. These they're are, both fans of each other. These are fans yeah. of each yeah. other. Uh, both two of the nicest guys that you can ever meet. Yeah, both with an immense respect for the culture and the game, and both put their heart and soul into the beats. And most importantly, both with both with some of the best and most extensive catalogs that you could have as a producer. Yeah, like yeah. you know, it's not too many people above these two. Yeah, uh, it, and I think it's harder to find a, a better battle than these two. You got to start bringing out uh, Dre, mm, Kanye, Prem, Prem, uh, yeah, fucking uh, sure. Neptunes, Pete. Yeah. Uh, Alchemist, Al definitely Just, mm-hmm. we've seen that, but and yeah, I we think saw, that we saw Al, Justin I think Al and Just are right underneath what I'm talking about as far as catalog wise. Well, they don't have as many like yeah. mainstream hits, I guess. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah I mean that's that's more. Sound. I'm talking yeah, about yeah. not talking about producing. Yeah. Right, well, right. I, and I also wasn't Havoc talking about Havoc would be another good one. That's yeah. that's I wasn't talking about iconic producers more. Of course, they're icons. Just the catalog, these two, and the years they've been around, and the hits that they've had, mm-hmm. these two match up with each other pretty well. Yeah. Not only the hits, but the, the passion that they have for it. For sure. These are two very passionate. They're very passionate. Oh, uh, Sw- Swizz is the best salesman uh, on earth. Yeah, they're very passionate. If, if he was not going to be a producer, he would be a car salesman, and he would sell every car. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I have Timbaland winning this beat battle. Like even the way Tim is breathing right there to the beat, like how he was leaning <laughs> in this chair. Like that's that that lets you know that they love this shit. Like they they would do this if there wasn't no. They would get in the studio with each other and do this type of shit if it wasn't no platform for us to see. You know what else I appreciated about this? And I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna try to word this in a way that doesn't offend anybody. I'm offended. <laughs> like Swiss has, like Rory said will always be one of the best salesmen slash hype men to even his own beats. Yeah. I mean, he, he, Swiss has always a been... king, too. Swiss has always been cool. Facts. Like, since a teenager, Rough Riders, the beats mm. he was doing, the rappers he was working with, mm. he has always been cool. Timbaland, I'm going to say not so much. And, and that was that part, for me, was on full display here, too. Like, Timbaland was a Virginia nigga to me in this battle. Mm. Like, my daughter's here. I'm the best ever at this shit. <laughs> I don't know how to work none of this shit. Like, Tim's discography is insane. He didn't even play, like, he that, missed a lot of good records. Right, he so, played one Missy record that I didn't, that I ain't heard. And that's another thing. Back, back to Swizz being cooler. I think Swizz kind of went out on the ledge of being vocal and being out there more Tim than was, Tim. Tim, Tim no, rapping. no, Tim rapped. Tim sang. Tim he was did in the everything. Videos, doing ad libs, all that shit. For sure, but I feel like From Swizz Swizz carried it more as like a cooler lifestyle shit than Tim did. Swiss, Tim was the Swiss producer, did it like an artist. Yeah, Tim did it like a, a producer. producer. Yeah, oh, okay. that's what I'm kind of getting at. All right. Even though like he's he's rapped, he's yeah. had, he sang, beatbox, all that shit. Yeah. He's, but I also feel like he kind of stepped back and let Missy get that first. Sure. Well, so, well, be clear. You just introduced another genius. Word. <laughs> like, yeah, <laughs> for sure. Anytime you put somebody Super. next to him, it's going to be some genius. Well, I mean, shit. I consider them in their early years a duo to some degree. Oh, they definitely, yeah. definitely were like big they were prior to Missy being They were co producing yeah. all that shit. Yeah. Let me say, I give Swiss a lot of credit. He st- Swiss stepped to Timberland, Swiss stepped to Just Blaze. True. Yeah. You get credit. You, oh, yeah. fam, niggas ain't doing that. Yeah. First of all, niggas been scared to say just Blaze name for a long time. Mm-hmm. Swiss went right to what's up? Yeah. What we doing? And got him out of here. No disrespect to Just. Of course not. 
Better selection of how he did that. Yeah. Better better salesman too. Yeah. In this battle, if, if you watch that battle, Swizz was really active in how he was it. presenting the records. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to perform it. Yeah. yeah. Even in this battle, you have to perform it. I think that if this battle, if this beat battle, were shorter. If they stuck to the hour that they said they would okay. do, and didn't do four hours, I might, I'm, I may have picked Swiss to win it. Mm. Because let me tell you, when I first clicked in, I stayed there for twenty minutes, and then I went to tweet, uh, "Hey y'all, Swiss is on on, on Instagram smoking Timberland's boots." <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> because if you were there from the start of it, mm-hmm. it was looking like, "Yeah, hey, what's what's going on? <laughs> this is not supposed to happen like this." And the longer this went. Like when Tim had enough, like maybe Tim was just drinking wine, enjoying the night. Right. Didn't know what this was going to be. Didn't really see the people in here, what we were saying. <laughs> Didn't understand the the clout of the people that were in the industry was in there. Right. You got clout? No, not me. <laughs> okay. The industry was in there. Yeah. I know. You in the, in the industry. No, I'm not. You just said all of us. You got me. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm in the industry by way of having to speak about the Guys, industry. Every, and, and, every, and everyone, large... everyone on this mic is in the industry. Yes. It's okay. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, we gonna, it's it's okay. We just gonna cop to it. It's okay, man. <laughs> but how? We're all in the industry. But it's cool. How? You're just more in it than us. You know what? One- Swizz and Tim. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. One day when we're closer to our renegotiation, I want to challenge that. Challenge what? What Rory just said. That you're more industry. No, that we are all in the industry. We are. We're in the industry. We're not industry. Mm, we in the streets. Yeah, I'm not in the streets. None of us are. That's true. <laughs> we're all. No, no. I said <laughs> we're, in we're all in the industry. <laughs> we're on the couch. Oh no, no. I didn't say in the streets the way Flex did. I said we're in the industry. We're not industry. Well, I guess I we're guess not industry people. My cliff note response to Rory is yes, we are all in the industry. If you just are looking at it through that by scope. definition, <laughs> by association. In, in my brain, we are the anti-crisis to the industry. I and, agree. In the role that we play to a streaming service and their role or their bout with the labels. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And if you understand that really, really well, we are the, ex- we, this ain't industry at all. They would want this to end ASAP. Sure. And I can't get further into it, so I won't. <laughs> um, Swizz and Tim. Swizz and Tim. Yeah, man. No, all right. So I when we came in here, I said, yo, I had Tim winning, and I also don't think it's fair because Tim's catalog is insane, and he's touched every genre ever. Like it's a really it tough. But well, how are you it's, listening to it though? Are you listening for the bigger record or the better? Well, that's what I wanted beat. to get to. We cannot call these things beat battles anymore because I think that's we we always change the definition of words the way we have freestyle. Like a freestyle is not a freestyle anymore; it's a written that mm-hmm. you rap. You're right. True. I think we're doing that same thing with beat battles this is a catalog now. Catalog battle. This is a catalog. Yeah, this yeah. is not a beat battle, and that's not fair because it should be a beat battle. Yeah, that's what that's. But it, but it does turn. I'm still into a listening to the beat, though. Me too. I'm not. I don't yeah, care so, how big the record well, or how the it case, charted. Well, that's Super Smoke because he's one of the most innovative producers yeah. of all time, if right. not the most innovative right. producer of all During time. During a quarantine with everyone bored and wanting to hear shit that they know, like, I'm cool with the let's go hit for hit thing. I think this is a cool way during a quarantine. Now, if we were at a venue and like there was real speakers and they were on MPCs and their laptops and their whole setups. Yeah, I'd like a real beat battle. Oh, but if exactly. you're on IG Live, yeah, give me records I know because the sound quality is not going to be that great. Let's judge it on who has the better record. If it was going to be a beat battle, they would have to be given the same tools and see who comes out yep. with the better beat. Give me, give me the highlights for you guys from this battle. I, I, can, I, can, I can start with mine. When, uh, when, when, uh, when Swiss played Band from TV, mm-hmm. it, was a, it was a stark reminder of what Band from TV is. <laughs> like Band, the record is different. Band Start from, forgetting how dope those beats were. Band from TV still is. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it just people are still free. It won't. Really. Yeah, it won't leave. No. Uh, when Swiss played uh, Bottoms Up, mm. or I mean not Bottoms Up, Down Bottom. Mm. I don't know the name of it. The Drag On record. Yeah, yeah, you know the record. Yeah. That's still one. To of the me, hardest. that's still one of the hardest beats ever made. Absolutely. And I thought the second that I, I always wanted. Like for for beat battles, I just be wanting to see a producer on the other side of a beat that I think is just and down and that drag on beat is one of those for me. Tim shocked me because he didn't even start playing all this shit. I four hours in, he still didn't play all this shit. That's the craziest part he of that. Killed, I was sitting there yelling he, records four hours in, he, like yo, he even touched the shit. Word, he didn't play one missing record. I, 
because I think at, at I think it's some. No, yeah, yes, he did. Yes, he, he did. did? Oh, yeah, because it. when he played "Get Your Freak On," oh okay, Swiss shut up. <laughs> <laughs> he when he played "One Minute Man," Swiss shut up. Oh, okay, I was like, that little section. Yeah, no, I was beaten. I was sitting there for hours until I just couldn't anymore. <laughs> um, when Tim played "One in a Million, yeah, I know that that sounds nuts, and I've always had a higher appreciation for that than probably. Most people, because that is a rap beat to me. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. What beat? One in a million. One in a million, Aaliyah. I'm about to play it for you now. That's not a... Uh, I guess the tempo. You, you could definitely rap on it. Oh, that's wrong record. That's, what, I was just what, about what, to what say. What's Neo doing? <laughs> I was like, I uh, he, did he play that I one? No, he had one of those. Neo has a oh, one in a million. Mm-hmm. Here we go. I'm sorry. I was going to say. <laughs> you know what it does? Like... It's a mood changer. And when you change a mood, you gain mad points from me. When you make it eerie, you gain mad points from me. And when you play an R&B beat that does that in a rap battle. So, not to cut you And when it's slow and when there's weird noises in it, like... His pockets and... This beat is hard to beat. Why I agree with you in that being the moment is, yeah, I can go back and forth with Swizz... On the hard records all day, I'll probably lose to Swizz in that. Yeah. But once I change to one in a million, what are you going to follow up with? Right. That's in a beat battle. That's what's dope to me. When you do something that like, all right, follow this because you don't even have nothing in this bag. Keep playing the same shit that sound the same. Yeah. Get in a bag now. Yeah. <laughs> Tim's yeah. got a lot when, of When he bags. forces you to go somewhere else. <laughs> that you don't have. Any, any you tr- may have one or two records. I got 15. Any, and he tricked Swizz with that and Swizz fell for it. And started getting in it. He played Angie Stone. Yeah. Uh, I wish I didn't miss you anymore. Mm. A record that I love. It's a good record. For but, a long time, I thought but that no. uh, Static Major did that uh, I didn't, one in a million record. I thought he produced that. He might have wrote on it. I know he wrote a lot of Aaliyah stuff. Actually, I don't. Did he do this album or the album after this? I'm not sure. But Tim produced this though. But I'll, Either way, Static wrote a bunch of Aaliyah man, shit. Man, what year did this song come out? 90 98, what? 98, maybe? 97? And we're uh, in 2020, and it still sounds like Brandon. it's in the future still. Yeah. 96. No, the way we big Janae up for this this sound, it all kind of comes from Aaliyah. Wait, stop. I would ne- I'm never putting, and this is no disrespect to Janae. I love you, Janae, another R&B songstress I love, who pioneered some shit. Uh... I'm not putting her in this category. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're you're misunderstanding what I'm saying. All right, give it to me. No, I'm not comparing the two. I'm saying that they're all Aaliyah's kids. Not that they hold the candle to her. They're all Aaliyah's kids in the The not super boisterous, like blowing out vocals. like The whisper song. It's not whispering because Aaliyah was singing, but they're all her kids. This genre of R&B to me is they're all Aaliyah's kids. The the soft tone. Yeah. No, no, I'm not comparing the two. I agree with that. Yeah. I agree with that. It comes from Aaliyah. I, uh, I was, Plus the baggy clothes, and I, all, like some there's some visual elements to it as well. Yeah, yeah. being sexy yeah, without bitches, the, bitches the are regular still covering their eye with their fucking bang. <laughs> <laughs> like, fam, what are we talking about here? Yeah. yeah, yeah, but Aaliyah's production was better than everybody. Yeah, yeah. Well, and she sought out and I Timberland and Timberland Missy. A That's a what I think Aaliyah's so doing. And I wouldn't mind hearing. I wouldn't mind seeing Janae do that with no ID. Because no ID is one of those. Yeah, For, oh, without question. Who beats No Idea in a beat battle? Like, I want to see some of these battles. No Idea would be a good matchup for... <sighs> Damn. No Idea got some sneaky little Bow Wow shit that y'all wouldn't even know. That's no true. Idea did. That's true. <laughs> That's true. Uh, damn, I don't know. Maybe him and... <sighs> He's in a weird place because he was kind of quiet for a long time. Like, his discography yeah. isn't as consistent as Timbaland or Preem yeah. or... Any and other and names he was mentioned? always such an album-based producer. That's true. Like, too. he wasn't rushing out to do your single. That's true. Like, too. he was like, all right, if we're going to yeah, get he in, wants the project. I yeah. got to do your whole album. Yeah. <laughs> Which yeah. is different because your focus is not so much, let me make a hit. Right. I got to make your project. Swiss is nice to me, man. Super nice. Like, when Swiss played Upgrade You, Tim had to shut the fuck up. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm saying this, of course, with all due respect. No, of course, of course. No, this, we, a, we know we this is that. competitive. Yeah, fam, you gotta send your daughter to bed. Up, <laughs> up, upgrade you was on when Swiss played. Uh, damn, what the fuck did he play? Like Swiss has been hard for so long. Pause. Yeah. 
Like he when, when he shit? played I'm a hustler. That's mm. what it was. Mm. It reminded me that oh man, this guy has been giving rappers the hard beat for a while. Yeah. <laughs> But Timberland, like he's he he's so innovative and like he had he introduced like a baby crying on a track as, right. a, as part of the beat, right. and just the pockets that he was using. People weren't finding those pockets. Yeah, like it, not with programming beats. See, he didn't not play. happening. I didn't hear that beat. I didn't. I didn't hear. Uh, Are you that somebody? And that's one of those to me. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Shit, I was telling these niggas. It's a great video. Tim could have played lobster and shrimp. That's that to me. That's one of the most slept on beats. I don't know. Well, yeah. And slept on J records. He didn't play, yeah. he didn't play P. D. Pablo either, did he? Uh, no, he didn't play P. D. Pablo. And I was waiting because that's another one that would have yeah. made Swiss go take a nap. Yeah. Go back in the house to your family. <laughs> Tim Timberland made Mag Maganu hard. Did he play if you want to give me more head than Sade? <laughs> Go ahead, home. Did Talk he play, to him now. Give me your bag, Rory. Did he play with a tie tie? I always oh loved that God. beat. <laughs> I didn't hear that. That beat was that crazy. Beat was crazy. I mean, he played, he played Pony, right? Yes. Okay. okay. All right. And it had. Because I was in and out. Yeah. It, it was Pony still. <laughs> yeah. I was waiting for him to start getting into his tweet bag. Mm. Tweet got some records. Yeah. Yeah. This beat is crazy. I want to hear this beat. <laughs> this beat is crazy. Yeah. I want to hear this beat. I would have loved for Tim to respond to the drag on shit with this. That would have been sick. Yeah. Yeah. I commend both these both of these brothers, man. They they uh what a what a great way to lead by example, like to be competitive but still have that camaraderie the way Maul was saying. What a great way to school all of the people that, because there was so many people in the comments that are newer school. Yeah, yeah, they don't, they don't know about a lot of, that, a lot of these records. Yeah, no, and not, not only all. that, and they were appreciating this shit. But even, even, uh, you know, you, if you were there, if you were outside for a lot of these records, when it, when he played them, it just brings back that feeling, like, damn, I remember this. Word. And a lot of these kids that now, I don't want to say kids, some of them in their twenties, they they don't know that feeling. They don't know. They're just hearing the beat, and they're like, okay, that's dope. But it's like, no, no, no. You don't understand what this did when this came out. See, I'm still listening. I agree with that. And I'm still listening, like you were saying, to the beat. Like, mm-hmm. granted, Big Pimpin' was one of Hov's biggest singles. Yeah. That but, shit was different. But the up. Big <laughs> Pimpin' beat yeah. crazy. is clearing... A room of producers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't care who is in there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But that's why I think it's unfair with Tim because you have Big Pimpin' and then you can play So Anxious afterwards. Right. Like, that's unfair. But So Anxious <laughs> is one of those two. Yeah, right. but it, his, it, it's, Timberland's range is It's just, unfair. Yeah. It's, that's but that's it's why like. Swiss gets all the respect from me. Yeah, because he called you? out. He called him out. He yeah. called that yeah. man out. You think Swiss don't know about Tim? Yeah. Of course he does. <laughs> and he was hanging with him the whole time. So, yeah. I, you know, it wasn't a blowout. Right. It wasn't a blowout. No, it wasn't a blowout. And listen, when Tim got drunk, fucking that score evened up a little bit. It got a little closer. <laughs> yeah, he started playing the same, little, hey. play, played the same record a couple times. Yeah, nah, when, yeah, Tim, yeah. When, Tim started looking, <laughs> when Tim started doing the old man looking at a nigga underneath the bottom of the glasses, you see how he looking at, <laughs> <laughs> at the phone? <laughs> Starting to look blurry on the laptop. Oh, that's what you're doing? Like, that's what you're doing over there? Okay. Fam, <laughs> I was in bed. That nigga dropped Cry Me a River and... That, yeah. That's why that's one of my favorite songs, though. The, the beat. Yeah. Yeah, I don't care what Justin did on That was great. Get your Britney, Britney hate off. Yeah. But well, that beat. It's crazy. Yeah, Timberland's, his, 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 his range is... I don't know. I don't... It'd have to be like a Pharrell to get him out of here. That's the only person that yeah, could... Yeah, that's, that's, that's a long... That's a... That's a as far as range. That's a long fight. Yeah. That's like... He didn't even you know get mean? into... In a lot of pockets. Dude. Yeah. Pharrell and them got a lot of pockets. Yeah. So. And, and Pharrell matches you on the weird. Yeah, I'm that's what I'm the, saying. He's I'm got putting, a lot of pockets. I'm putting the weird shit in my beat, and now what's up? Yeah, I got weird drums. Yeah, that would actually yeah. be very interesting. He got a lot of pockets. That would be very interesting because there's some joints Pharrell did that people don't even know he did. Facts. You know what I mean? Tim too. I didn't know Tim did the drums on "Good Life" by Kanye. Yeah, I had no idea. When yeah. he played I, that, I was like, I don't want to hear, hear, hear that shit. No, nah, I'm not shit. mad at that though. Fuck that. Well, all right. So that's then play the drums and mute the rest of the sound. No, fuck that. Take the drum. Take take the drums out and just let it be the sample. Not a word. Drums are the most important shit in the fucking beat. And on good life. Fact. I'm not saying that. I'm saying that. Well, all right. Your so drums so are in, whack, in, in these, these catalog battles, clearly co-production is okay. I'm not mad at that. Me either. 
Oh, you're dog. Can, hey, can hey, you hey. play beats that he, you didn't really make that you had but, other people make for you and then you put your name on it? I hate when Rory get his hate off because he knows something we was fighting about behind the scenes and he, <laughs> <laughs> he fucking alludes to it before we could bring it up. Fuck out of here, Rory. <laughs> get the fuck out of here, Rory. Uh, Parks, answer Rory. Uh, answer him knowing where here's, he's going. Here's the thing. <laughs> I'm going to say yes. Yeah, you can. Oh, it's your you name. Can. Yeah. Oh, you, got right. your, <laughs> you got your name on it. You put it together. You paid for it. Because not for nothing, even when a producer has ghost producers, he's often still producing the record meaning mm-hmm. he's coaching the vocal he mm-hmm. might tell him to switch this drum he might add a drum mm-hmm. he yeah, might change a the lot bass. of those, a lot of them are That's using producing. using their drum kits they're yeah. giving their producers their drum kits right here's all my noises and sounds and everything right, right. or, or you'd, se- you'd make the beat send me a session i'm gonna take your drums out yep and i'm gonna put a different bass line to it and that's that's a wrap not turn up the that. bpms a little bit so so no i think we finally need we finally need bink versus just Mm-mm. that'll never happen though of course not. I like I like Bink versus A Rap. Justice League versus Justice. Versus oh, I, like, I like Bink versus A Rap. I like Bink hmm. versus A Rap. I, I like that. I like Bink versus A Rap. I like A-Rab. Justice, League. and that probably will happen yeah. sooner than Bink and Just. Yeah. Bink and Just on that. I like I like Bink and A Rap. Justice League versus Just. Did Timberland play uh, Lloyd Banks? I'm so fly. That's a battle. That's a battle. Wait a minute, man. That's a battle. I didn't even think of that part. That's a battle. What'd you say? Justice, Justice League versus Just. Versus Justice League. Who's the real Just? And will Justice be served? I don't know, Maul. I don't nah, know. Nah, Maul's marketing no, now. Ma, hold up, man. Maul's marketing <laughs> now. Yeah, Maul's will drunk. Justice be served? No, 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 You know, Rory, I just, you know, sometimes if I want to call ice. Maul is marketing now. I mean, nah, that nigga get us a bucket, won't he? <laughs> Joe, don't do that. Don't do that. That nigga get us a bucket, don't he? <laughs> might, have to, might have to group text uh, the guys and see if, see if they be into it. Let me tell you something. I I, I think I can I think I can get uh, Jermaine Dupri and Puff to finally go at it. Mm, I think I can. That would be a good battle. That would be interesting. They got a lot of hits between Damn. the two of them. If I, can catch, if I can catch Puff in between him getting twenty four hour massages at home. <laughs> <laughs> Cause his life is just different. When you're a billionaire, you just say, nah, he'll, he'll, nigga, he'll do it while he's getting a massage. He'll Imagine be on the laptop. A, a 24 hour yeah. massage. <laughs> That's puff. <laughs> yeah. Havoc versus Al would be a good one, actually. I would like Ooh. that a lot. Yeah. I that like would be that. a good one. Would they do that? I don't know. They're very good friends, so. Yeah, that's why I don't think they yeah, would. Yeah, I, I don't know. Yeah, but it's competitive. It's, yeah. it's, it's, not, and, it's, and, it's not beef. I mean, they worked so much together. <laughs> yeah. Listen, who who, who plays guy. what records? Yeah. Yeah. That's the difficult part. No, they play the same record, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> I play it better I'm than on you. This too. Yeah, I play it better than you. Berg said he's looking for mustard in the daytime with a flashlight. I would like that a lot. Ooh, uh, that's, that's a good battle. A, too. All right, time out. Time out. Let me just say this. That's interesting. Mustard is on the list too of people that's probably too rich to deal with this. <laughs> he for sure. Mustard is not. Do you have fun? Hitmaker or whatever your name is. <laughs> <laughs> but, like, mustard ain't mustard. Acts rich. So he's got a lot of hits. Berg too. is rich too, though. I know, but Berg still ingratiates himself amongst the people. He still acts like an underdog. He's still an underdog in the producer uh, world. Yeah. I think. Yeah, yeah, he is by perception. Yeah, but he's he's fairly new to producing records. I want him to start talking his shit more. He produced a lot of great records. And 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 to me, part of Berg's genius is not so much the production. Like Berg makes the song, right? Like he arranges. He has his first to do this, do he, that. He like, does. It's his, it's, it's his creation. It's producing. Uh, it's Pierce, producing. Pierce, yeah. don't kill me. He does real, his Quincy real. Jones he's, shit. I'm not touching yeah. nothing. Yeah. I'm yeah. fucking arranging everything. He's not yeah. beat making. Yeah. He's actually producing. Yeah, well, he's producing. While Mustard does a lot more of let me actually touch the computer. Yeah. 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 Wale hit me and said, one day we got to have a real conversation about producers versus beat makers. Yeah, that's a I'm conversation that yeah. is overdue. And I think it's a conversation that a lot of people wouldn't want to touch. There's a lot of people that wouldn't want to do it because they would be forced to realize that they're, that they're uh, not a producer. They're tracking, <laughs> they're tracking engineers or producers and should be getting royalty exactly. points. Exactly. I just want to have the. Hold on, man. I, we ain't even. Parks, was the, your foot the, on the line? The no, no, I was way back. <laughs> okay. I was way back. Was, was this foot oh, on we the got line a stretch you? five. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you bet, though, you had a stretch five. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's, he's been working on it. He's been working yeah, on that. So Brooke Lopez, head yeah. ass nigga. Man. Always, <laughs> yo, always back to the center. <laughs> look at this guy. Yeah. Yeah. Always back to the center. Yeah. Uh, let me let. Uh, yeah, mustard. Mustard is not doing that. Hey, another nigga I don't think is coming down to play with you, mere mortals, is Mike Will. I keep seeing his name floating around. Oh, that. Who's, who's going up against him? Him versus Mustard would actually be a good one, too. No, no one. one. No one. No one. No one. Let me show you. And that. I love Mustard. I right love now. Mustard, but Why no one. Because Mike Will is I'm, like the Timberland. I'm going to take it somewhere else. <laughs> Mike, and you won't have a response. Mike Will is the Timberland of that. His, his, yeah. yeah, his range is... is <laughs> of that. And don't, no, don't get not, twisted. Mustard I'm not has, putting Mike Will with Timberland. 
no, 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 no. no. We're no. saying in okay. I in hope this, that was clear. In this comparison, in this group right here, his range is nuts. Yeah. Mustard, Listen, Mustard, Mustard has done R&B Mu- records. He's a great Rihanna Mustard record. Mustard like, not want but, not one part no. of Mike Will. <laughs> I'm with you. In in my opinion, I could be wrong. Mustard might be listening. Like, man, <laughs> I hope he is. I would love they to both see load up the kidding. They both have a lot of hits. <laughs> But I think that's that. I don't think this battle's gonna that's be. That's that Swizz versus Timbaland shit. Like, yeah, for that first hour, you guys will be neck and neck until I put on one in a million. <laughs> All right, now tonight or well, last yeah, last night. Last night, you you've all seen this battle. <laughs> no, no, s- slow down. Let me pat myself on the back first. Go ahead, narcissistic Joe. You deserve it. I'm serious. Well, first of all, Rory, let me pat myself on the back. Uh, myself and Russ. For being two people to give away money to the less fortunate and people who may be in need. That was dope. How that about, was very dope. How about that? That was dope. Fledge, how about, how about, uh, Fledge uh, hey, Joe. Well, hey, hey, uh, 119 minutes in, none of my friends highlighted the great move that that was. Mm. But y'all are coming no, and diss me no, in minute I don't, two. Know, I don't even know y'all what y'all talking about. Y'all diss me it, in minute it was, two. Uh, well, you it right. was fire till you said it. I really don't know what y'all talking about. <laughs> I don't. I don't know what y'all talking about. <laughs> It's not important. That's no, not, it, it, it was it was super fire. Yeah, it was. It was it, internally, I said to myself, "Wow, that was a really dope thing that Joe was doing." Now I think it's corny, <laughs> just because you just said it. <laughs> like, well, don't tell us your charity. Well, Rory, no, I'm, you're <laughs> I right. I thought it was great. You're right. Now you now you're doing it like, hey, look at me and my charity. No, 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 <laughs> like, no, look, no. I give back. No, 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 no. Because you're right. And <laughs> normally, under normal circumstances, if we were not dead in the middle of a pandemic, I would agree with you because that's corny, my nigga. Just do charity and shut the fuck up. <laughs> but I have to highlight highlight it because it should be happening a lot more. I agree. Fuck me. I'm broke still compared to these niggas. <laughs> that's why I like Russ. Russ came out and said, yo, I got 20 racks. I'm Russ, giving it away right now. Russ is not broke. Well, Nowhere Word. near. <laughs> nowhere, nowhere near. Yeah. Russ is the furthest way, thing from broke. Way more money than Joe. But, yeah, Ru- Russ... Russ has way more money than most rappers. Russ stepped up. Yeah, that's true. One day we'll talk about how rappers don't really have that much money. But, uh... True. <laughs> um, yeah, I like Russ doing that. Like, I want, it, I want that challenge to start of the people that got a couple dollars to spare because the strip club is closed or wherever <laughs> it is. Give it to the people. The government won't do it. They won't put humanity in front of fucking capitalism. Everything that they say <laughs> keeps telling you that. Uh, Trump want to kill all the old people. If you're over eighty, he don't give a fuck about you. You could die. He wants well, all to go back to work. Kill himself then? Huh? Nothing. No, he wouldn't. He's, do that. he's old as fuck. He wouldn't do that. Uh, all right. The real question is, did you 103 see it? Because that'll tell us everything we need to know. Did I 103 see it? That means you didn't. My I guy. Didn't. My guy. Didn't. My guy. All right. Didn't, didn't do, do it for a tax break. I love it. No. <laughs> <laughs> My guy. I'm glad. I'm glad you answered that correctly. Yeah, no, I didn't. And I think I said 103C wrong. I don't even think that's it's, all right. it's something like that. It's close enough. <laughs> so I was bored at home, like I've been. And I said, you know what, man? Let's just start some shit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Let's just start some shit. And I called Boy Wonder. I'm like, yo, man, what's up, man? If I find somebody for you to battle, would you do it? <laughs> and he said, well, not really what I do, but I mean, if you get somebody, man, I'm with all the smoke, man. It's whatever you want to do. <laughs> like, yeah. I was like, wow. Like, who could battle Boy Wonder? And just being an immature idiot, I tweeted Hit Boy. Mm. I didn't put much thought into it. It's a good battle, though. It is. And I didn't think that Hit Boy would really jump at the opportunity because I have such a high respect for Boy Wonder's catalog. Mm. And Hit Boy don't give a fuck about that. (laughs) (laughs) It's the battle battle of the boys. Ah! Uh. Who is the boy? Who is the boy? Who's the real boy? (laughs) Honestly. Listen, I'm really excited about this battle. By now, if you're listening to this, this battle has already happened. So that's great, too. Me and Rory have a stake bet. We do. We have a stake bet. I got my money on uh, Wanda. Got my money on Hit Boy. Rory has his money on Hit Boy. Maul, give it to me. Where you at with this? You know he's going over, yo. I don't know. I don't know that. I haven't talked to Maul. I don't know Maul's relationship with Hit Boy. Hit no. Boy's Rock Nation. More is Rock Nation. No, mm. uh, is Hit Boy Rock Nation? I, I, I got, I got I Boy think Wonder. I wouldn't know. I got Wonder. I think he's yeah. Rock Nation. I got Wonder. I take Boy Wonder. You take Wonder. Yeah, I got Wonder. Mm. Parks takes Wonder. Wonder. Erickson. Wonder. Savant. Wonder. All right. Let me see if I can get the man on the phone real quick. The, and Hit Boy is the boy. I, he's phenomenal. I just think the Boy Wonder has a lot more records. We'll we'll get into it. Let us yeah. stir up some trouble. Let's. Uh, yeah. I'll, what I'll was the Mayweather shit? Hit Boy's great. First 24, 24 hours. What did Mayweather do when they used to yell at each other via oh, HBO yeah. docs? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. 
I don't remember what it was yeah. called, though. Yeah, the first 72. First, yeah, it was something. <laughs> so, it wasn't first 48. It was yeah, no, no. first 20. Something I don't 24 know. 24 7 All Access? 24 7. So 24 maybe 7. that was that. I don't know. It was. It was 24 7 All Access. <laughs> all right, let's see what's going on. Let's see if we can get the real boy on the phone. The real boy. Oh, fuck. I fucked up. Here we go. We, yo, Joe. Boy Wonder, this is Joe Budden calling from the Joe Budden podcast. How are you feeling? Oh, oh shit! Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Terrence on the infamous Joe Budden podcast. Hold up, man! I got <laughs> I got to hit an air horn for the legend on the phone. Man. Hey, let me get my battle bias out the way. No, I think that is a legend. Now, definitely. Listen, by yeah. the time that people hear this wonder, the battle will have already occurred. I'm in a room yep, of yep. one, two, three, four, five, six. I make uh. I make what seven, six of the seven here have you winning this battle tonight. Let me go yep. ahead and take a page out of uh, Maul's book. Rory, <laughs> Rory is the lone who, man. Who, who's, who's the who's the one it, odd vote? Rory, it, it is I. It's Rory. One that was good. Bro. It's, it's, Rory got coronavirus, bro. <laughs> <laughs> not feeling well. <laughs> Wonder, you know you're my guy too, but now I'm, I'm taking a hit, boy, man. Well, tell Wonder why. It's, it's, all, it's all good, bro. We I want to know your strategy sick. here. And I see. I don't even know if I want to. good, bro. If I'm in Hit Boy's corner, I, I don't want to give you are. gems yet. Are yeah, you gonna play as mostly Drake, Drake records? Yes, nigga. No, you know, yeah, for sure. But like niggas, like I have a lot more. Records oh, I know than that. Drake I know you do. So, but I'm just trying to see your strategy here. Fam, don't huh? hey, don't know. You're not getting strategy, my nigga. <laughs> hey, hey, I wonder. I only call. I only call to see how you was feeling. What your vibe was. What's the mood? I mean, huh? I'm ready, bro. I'm just here. Like, when you called me that day and you said, yo, would you do this? I said, I'm with the shit. So I'm with whatever, whoever, why ever, however. You know what I'm saying? I'm here. I'm bored. I, I know. I, like that. I know. I, 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 told that, I told that over here. I said that same story over here. Rory was looking at me like that couldn't have been the case. <laughs> yeah. I'm, 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 I'm cool. I'm yo. cool, bro. I'm, just, I'm ready for, for anything, bro. Noah let, me know that you you know was, Noah let me know that you was really with the shits. I just saw a clip with you and Elliot. And Elliot was yeah. like... Uh, you know, Elliot uh, nervously said, hey, man, uh, what are you going to do when he plays niggas in Paris? You just laughed. <laughs> you, you just laughed at him. Hey, come man. on, man. Yeah. <laughs> come on, man. Niggas in Paris is hard. Yo! Yo, this is Come gonna, on, now. Yeah, no. Nah, hey, Wonder, man. This is going to be great. Let me tell you, me and everybody here, and I'm sure everybody in hip-hop is really appreciative yeah, for that, real. that y'all are even doing this. Word up. I, I want to say yeah. I think this is the first time that uh, two niggas from y'all generation is getting this done, right? Yeah, I think so. I think so. I don't think anybody's done this yet, but I'm, I'm with it, and it's all for the culture. You know, a lot of people have been hitting us, trying to get involved, but this is just strictly for the people and like for the it. culture, bro, and just for fun. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is this is our shit, so... We just want to get this off, let people have fun, enjoy it, and just like you know, create awareness. Because I think me and me and Hip Boy, like I don't think we get our just due. You know what I'm saying? So agreed. It's, it's good to, uh, for us to just get together and play some stuff that people just didn't know that we even did. So yeah, I think you're gonna smack him around the head. I do. Hey man, I know, bro. You, I'm you, just gonna say this, bro. I was born in the home of the sound clash. I won three Battle of the Beatmakers in Toronto. Uh, this is like this is like my shit. You know what I'm saying? So, this is bag. Listen, man. Now, Wonder, talk your shit. I'm yeah. glu I'm glued to my phone to, at 10:30 tonight. <laughs> listen, Wonder. I I'm know you got a you got a battle battle to get ready for your fold. You got your folders ready? Of course, hey! of course. Bro. Come on, man. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Hit Boy is no slouch, but. You already know what time I'm on. I'm on some demon time right now. Nigga, so we coming with Drake know. and M records, man. Fuck is Hit Boy talking about? <laughs> <laughs> he got Drake and M records too. Couple Rihanna records sprinkled nah, in. He got don't, Rihanna don't records too. No, I know. I know. Don't, Listen, don't get it twisted. I know. Hit, hit Boy got some sleep. I know. I'm not sleeping on him. I will not sleep on him. And and I definitely won't because I'm sure Rory's about to call him next. For sure. We have to, we have to oh, stir yeah. up some trouble yeah. even though people have heard this already. The no, battle has happened. It's fine. <laughs> Let's check on him. <laughs> All right. Bro. Rory, it's okay, man. I forgive you. We all make mistakes, bro. <laughs> Wonder, we, we love, love you. bro. We love you, man. I'll talk to you soon. Yeah, I love you guys, man. Take it easy, man. One. Peace. Peace. I, listen, man. I, I got to be I honest. I just don't think y'all fully. I got to be fully... honest with you guys. No. That don't sound like a guy that's worried. 
Montana. Do Joe Biden. Actually, we could turn on French Montana ain't worried about nothing right now. <laughs> he don't sound worried at all. <laughs> and when he said, I'm glad this is happening because I feel like me and um, Hit Boy have been slept on for a long time, I took that as, yo, I've been slept on for a long time and I'm going to make him an example. <laughs> <laughs> that's what that's what I took that as. Boy One is one of the, uh, the greatest of his generation for sure. Oh, without question. Not even Gotta a question. Be. Without Gotta question. Be. Without possibly the greatest of his generation, honestly. There's an argument to be made yeah. there. No, one is sick. It's gonna be fun, man. I, I I do like I like Hit Boy a lot. But uh I think again, uh Boy One that just has he he has a lot more of those type of beats that one you probably forgot about. Yeah. And just, you know, they but just I, hit, they see, just that's hit what different. I think with, with Hit Boy's catalog. I just don't think y'all are fully aware of oh, his no, I'm catalog. Fully I'm fully aware. I, I, just because I, I, I you don't throw Boy. his tag on shit Boy. like that no more. No, 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 no. You, I you know, fuck with you know why I don't fuck with Rory? Because we've been on the Edgewater deck with 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 the gentleman, with the boy, don't no. gentleman nigga. He's not the boy. <laughs> with the boy. Drake is the boy. No, in producer world, boy wonders the boy. Okay, he can be the boy, and he produces for the boy. He's the boy that produces for the boy. <laughs> yeah, he's the boy. They're the boy boys. <laughs> <laughs> Pause. But we have been on that Edgewater roof deck, mm-hmm. and our faces have been scrunched and, up. And look to the right. And invited Boy Wonder over to just play some shit, and he blew the roof off of a roof deck. <laughs> yeah, there was no ceiling there. He was also right. there. R- Rory's mouth dropped to the floor <laughs> no, over some of the music that was that, being played. Whoa, whoa hold so, on. He was also Me there taking, when Vinyls, by the way, would also smoke a beat battle. Hell yeah, yeah. No, Vinyls is sick. And shout out to Cardiac, by the way, for doing all but of. You, uh, he, he's another one that would smoke a beat battle on the low. Sneak you being one of those fan, you being one fair. of those fans right now that I don't like. Just okay. because I picked Hit Boy does not mean I don't. Love and respect, and fully aware of what Boy Wonder does. Call your man, man. <laughs> you just be yeah, you want to be call, one of them weird call, fans. Call, call your man. He don't even answer for you. I'm about to say he might. <laughs> he might. He might not even he answer. Don't even answer for you. <laughs> He's not giving an answer. Well, he's busy. How, how you gonna pick a nigga that? Yeah, he better. Get, he better be busy. <laughs> but Boy Wonder's fine. Yo. What's good with you? This is Rory from the Joe Budden Podcast. You are live on air right now. What's the deal? What's going on, hey, bro? Hey, boy, I'm tech man, man. What's the deal? What's up with y'all? We, uh, we just had Boy Wonder on the phone. Hit hey, boy, we love you. Hey, man, I, I, you started up, man. I had to get involved quickly. Hey, <laughs> hey, listen, listen. I'm going to keep it a bean with you. First of all, you two gentlemen get all the respect in the world for me. Anybody that actually participates in one of these uh, producer beat battles, I have an no, immense amount of up. respect for it because niggas ain't getting off their porch to do that. All you niggas no, are so. uber successful. All you niggas is rich. Like the fact uh-huh. that y'all are doing this, I tip my hat to y'all, right? I'm not alone in that, right? No, nah, it's, it's definitely for the culture and like, you know, watching the Swizz and the Timberland joint, like that that inspired me and it took me back and it just gave me that, that feeling of that essence, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So I'm trying to do the same thing for our era. Are you, are you afraid? No, nah, I'm not afraid at all, man. I got some, I got some shit in the tuck, man. Do you know that he Hit, did not afraid? Hit boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's true. That is Hit true. boy. I don't think everyone in this room is fully aware of your catalog because right now it's six you know to what, one. Bro, I have I'm, you winning. I'm, I'm, the I'm other six have Boy Wonder winning. I don't think they're fully yeah, aware wanna, of how you get busy. Cut you off, bro. But my mom literally just walked in the crib, heard a, a Travis Scott song playing, and was like, "Yo, little sister, play that." I didn't even know you produced that shit. My mama, dog. So of course. <laughs> so what? Yeah. So what? Well, boy, Wonder gonna show do? niggas tonight, though. <laughs> nah, hit boy got joints. Like no, listen, hit boy got joints. Hit boy is one of the niggas we call when we needed a joint. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah. like, uh, like, hit boy, are you gonna play any of your slaughterhouse records during the beat battle? <laughs> <laughs> crazy as hell. Hey, we just gonna have to see, man. We gonna see how it go. Uh, um, how do you think Boy Wonder is gonna follow up you playing "Flawless" by Beyonce? Because I'd like to know. Hey, man, honestly, I don't know. Cause, but I know, I know them Canadian dudes is real thought out, man. So, <laughs> he's he, he come, he coming from that beat battle era anyway. So you know what I'm saying? I, I'm not like a beat battle type nigga. I just get my joints off where I can. But you know what I'm saying? It's it's gonna be interesting. It's gonna be fun for sure. Do you do you think you guys do you think you guys will honor the hour time limit? Honestly, I don't know. You know, this quarantine shit different, man. Niggas is bored as hell. So yeah. if they want us to keep going, we probably just going to keep going. And we, I got some beats too, so it's whatever. Instrumentals. Yo, and see, that's where I think you and Boy Wonder can uh, separate yourselves or separate this from what Tim and Swiss did. Like, they cataloged it out with a bunch of songs. You two niggas, yeah. I think, 
might just throw on a beat. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah. Both nah, of them. I, I, th- I think I think that'll be uh, that'll be like the, the standout moment for sure. Just playing shit that niggas ain't heard yet. Mm. Yeah, that's that tough. in the tuck bag that's is tough. different. Yeah, that's yeah. a fact. Yeah, but one that got some shit in the talk. Both of them oh, have shit in the talk. I know, bro. Come on, nigga. That's one of the only dudes. I'm like, okay, any anytime he drop, you gotta really listen. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I like that too. That both both of y'all. I like that the the dudes that are partic- each other. they are super respectful. They yeah. not this ain't this ain't that. <laughs> yeah, this ain't that. Like yeah. they letting the beat speak. Yeah, I'm gonna get some no, popcorn and I will be glued to this. Hit boy, I have a bet with Rory. We got a steak riding on this. You funny as shit for that too. I saw that tweet. <laughs> Yo, man, I, yeah, man, listen, man, I was too, I was too excited. Uh, I was too excited, and I thought I had got the wrong kite. I got the wrong kite. The kite I got was like, oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hit boy ain't say that, man. Hit boy ain't say yo, call Rock Nation. <laughs> He did not say that because then I'm gonna look at Hit Boy different. <laughs> That's but, funny. As but nah, man. you 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 was ready. I was wrong. I apologize. I was wrong. Nah, nah, nah. We we, we in there, man. Uh, you know what? You know what really tipped it though. I'm not gonna even bullshit you. This nigga Vince Staples hit me like, you know they trying to mark you out on Twitter. I'm like, nah, bro. I had to. You know what I'm saying? I had to chime in ASAP. Wait, but but. Oh, Vince, that's, that's oh, not like Vince just gassing. Yeah, before I had responded, he was telling me like niggas was on my head. Like, nigga, what you gonna do? Oh, so, I know. Yeah, yeah, good, jump, good. Yeah, because I, I, I was on your head. head. Yeah, no, no, I was on <laughs> your head. I'm already knowing. Because we deserve that. We deserve to hear this. Yeah. Word. No, uh, straight up. It, yeah, no, nah, it wasn't. It wasn't personal. I got all the love and respect for you. You know that, right? I don't have to tell you that. But no, that's all love. I'm, I'm, okay. I'm excited. Yeah. I don't want to take you away from getting your folders right. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm putting it together. I'm still locking in. You know, it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a tough one, but we gonna have fun regardless. Well, yeah. what's up? I like that. Uh, before before we let you go, anything from Detroit too that Big Sean announced that you could tell us because you were on three of the records in the promo video. Hey, you might you might just want to watch the battle, man. You might get something, man. You might get something mm. that these ain't even expecting. I'm glad you said that. I think Hit Boy did one of the beats that I like a lot on Big Show and Shit. Yeah. That's hard. That that hey, Hit Boy, I heard, uh, I heard um, some of the joints you did with Benny. Okay. That's what's up. Nah, Benny, that boy locked in. Hey, I heard. He played need, about four of them shits for me, and I ain't going to lie. I need that. He, it sounded he really, really something. good. It sounded really good. Yeah, nah. I like, you know, everybody that, that really know them and, and know Benny and been around him, they like, bro, the shit the shit you brought out of him, we don't, we don't even know where that came from. Yeah. Like, that, he just sound refreshed on your shit. So, you know, that's always good feedback. I just can't wait to get this shit to the people. That's a fact. Well, listen, man. Thank you from all of us here. I'm sure I speak. Nah, thank y'all. See what y'all doing. I'm, I'm, I'll be watching, you know what I'm saying? I peep, I peep all this shit. So, you know what I'm saying? Keep doing what y'all doing, too. Definitely. Listen, if you get smoked, I'm going to talk bad about you. <laughs> I already know, nigga. It's all good. My nigga, love. Good luck tonight. Yes, sir. Peace. Yeah, we couldn't get nicer guys for this stuff. <laughs> right. Like I mean, that's when you're young and you making money and you doing what you love, it's no reason to really have Yeah, they're 20 something legends. Yeah. It's like, man, yeah, we yeah, having yeah. fun, man. And you're a producer. You don't have to put on, like, the aggressive yeah, side. Like, you can just we, make we both great know music. We, we capable of. I respect what he do. He respect what I do. And we just gonna have fun. Yeah. Neither one of their phones is gonna be a stop ringing for work. No, <laughs> yeah. no. God, no, no, no. no. This no, is no, only no. gonna enhance yeah. things. Yeah. Yeah. The phone's gonna ring a little yeah. harder. Yeah. yeah, win or lose. Yeah. Yeah. But, but the potential for both of them to play a, just a beat. Because yeah. that, they will. Yeah. I, I, yeah. I bet that that will happen. Mm-hmm. That's gonna be crazy. Yeah, because then it turns into a B battle, right? Yeah. A real one. Yeah, I would love. I don't know if this will be the structure. Matter of fact, are you moderating this shit? Like, no. How is this starting? I want nothing to do. I want to enjoy it like a fan. They asked uh, the fucking call Cherry asked me if I wanted to host. That I wanted because it was my idea. No, yeah, I don't want nothing to do. I don't want to monetize it. I don't no, no, I didn't host. mean that. I mean just yeah, how that's it's gonna start. Because I, I don't want nothing to do with nothing. Yeah. I would have liked just one type of structure because structure sucks with these types of things, but. All right, let's do catalog for the first hour. Then for the next hour, let's do beats. Well, first of all, they only agreed to an hour. Once they go past that, they, they, on they, they in their own bag. Yes. They're, <laughs> Joe, they're, they're definitely going past, past that hour. Definitely. I think so Without too. question. Yeah. I, I think so, too. But we got to recognize that this is a favor from these guys. Oh, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. yeah absolutely. Like, absolutely. I've gotten invoices from them both. Trust me. Mm-hmm. This is a favor. This is this is, yes. this is generosity. Mm-hmm. I ain't gonna try. Yo, all right. After the first hour, then I need you to. Nah, yeah, nah, nah, nah. Y'all, y'all cook. Do whatever you want. But boy, am I excited. Yeah. Bam, we we moved the podcast time so we could be on for this shit. That's right. a fact. 
Yeah, no. Yeah, I'm like, which I'm, I I ain't like that they they went for the Pacific time seven thirty. Like I oh, like, is that what it is? Yeah. Oh, we gotta wait till ten thirty. We gotta oh, wait for ten thirty, man. That makes yeah. sense though. <laughs> no, I like it. That makes yeah. sense. Yeah, I like it. No, nah, I'm I'm trying to watch that now. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe it. what I will say is Boy Wonder got to be fronting a little bit about niggas in Paris shit. That, that, that's gonna smack you. Oh yeah, you're that's gonna a tough you, one. You're gonna feel that. That's tough. Click, click. You gonna feel it too. True. Flawless Beyonce, you are gonna feel it. Yeah. Goldie, Goldie's Goldie. Goldie, you're shit. definitely gonna feel it. You are gonna feel click. <laughs> yeah. You are gonna feel flawless. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Shit, even the backseat freestyle, you're gonna feel. True. That's, that's my beat. Nice for what? That's my beat. <laughs> I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna feel that one. Really? Nice for what? I love that beat. The Drake record. That's a Murder Beats record, though. Is it? Yeah, it's not a boy one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Or a hip boy beat. I'm yeah. tripping. My uh, bad. Yeah, I wouldn't have thought that. It didn't sound Shit, like I even think feeling myself with Nicki and Beyonce gets it done. He did do done. God's Plan, though. Who? Wonder. I thought yeah. Murder Beats did that, too. Uh. Oh, that gets it done. That's a good beat. I don't want to hear God's No, he got some. Nah, listen, he that. got some shit, man. I don't want to hear God's Plan to be better. That's, that's, that's your AO technology. I, you, Hit Boy has. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Hit Boy can play sicko mode, too. He can play racks in the middle. Like, can you guys. It's going to be fun. What is that noise? I was moving the thing. Oh. Um, yeah, that's it, man. I don't, I don't, I'm excited. Yeah, I'm hyped. I'm excited. Uh, listen, don't, don't kill us because y'all already saw the battle and we were given our premonitions. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, you were wrong. Yeah, oh, no, no, yeah. 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 They're going to kill us. Twitter, 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 Twitter that. loves yeah. that. I understand that yeah. we recorded this hours before. No, that, that doesn't matter because they, they would have known exactly what would have happened. Yeah. Right. Everyone on Twitter they, is they a fucking called genius. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, they called I, I do, it. I hate when they do that. I yeah. do. They do it do, every right. single time. Like, yeah. so. so. like wow. Yeah, every music opinion you've ever had is trash now. Like, I, fam, I didn't know. I can't believe you forgot to mention, fam, we were on the cuff. Just talking. This wasn't planned. We didn't think about this. We don't script this. Oh, this is dope, though. I, I I I hope that more producers continue this at least during quarantine time. Yeah, I know when we're allowed to go outside, dudes is kings is busy getting money. But for quarantine time, and it looks like we'll get at least two more months of quarantine time. Um, yeah, I hope they continue this. And let me just say, I am. I'm, I would like I'm, I would like artists if we're doing catalog and all you're doing is playing off your no, laptop. No, please, 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 don't make it corny. Don't make it corny. I think some artists would be good. No way. Some. Artists to battle, they get too, they get too emotional. I don't want to hear it. Like rapping, I don't want to hear no, it. No, 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 catalog. None of them. Like play their music, mm. play their records. It's not a one I want to hear. <sighs> artists yeah. are way too sensitive. Yeah, yeah. Like producers are artists too. Don't get it twisted. Producers but, are sensitive. Yeah, but it's not sensitive different. in the same type of way. Yeah, it's like, like we just sensitive. We just see them giving it up to each other about liking each other's work and shit like yeah, that. Yeah, it's uh, producers are sensitive if you start. Taking like their drum pattern, for and sure. You start applying it to your your catalog, then it's like, yo, you still in my drum. I think drum, producers right? have the same catty thoughts that they might know. They might have the same too. thoughts, but they don't act on it as much as producers are quiet. As someone who's really good friends studio. with a lot of producers, there's yeah. some truth to that, but not really. And producers in work industry, more together too. One. Yeah, they work together more. And I'll be honest with you, Rory. Part of what makes this so great to me is highlighting the producer. Like well, we we stopped reading credits. Yeah. We don't know who makes what. The producer yeah. is like, the producer yeah. probably the to, most important person in which, the studio. Yeah, I meant yeah. to bring up when we were talking about Swizz and Timberland. During that whole thing, I was like, all right, there was a million rappers during this eras that they're playing, but look at how important the producer is. Word. Like look at the eras y'all have dominated, the yeah. two of y'all. Yeah. Producers like, just have a two longer, of y'all dominated. Producers this shit. typically have a longer career. And longer I think we're gonna see that with Boy Wonder and Hit Boy too. Like, all right, y'all for the past ten years have made Good majority of our favorite music. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Listen, what Swiss has managed to do with a Casio is, <laughs> is uncanny. And I'm being facetious with the Casio. I, I don't know what he uses because I'm, I'm not a producer. Yeah. But a whatever that machine is, yeah. he's the king of it. He's mastered, he's mastered <laughs> yeah. it. Yeah. Swiss ain't even give him fucking. And I think Swiss did. Uh, what's that murder ink? No, Irv might have did that. I'm sorry. Irv would also be another guy that could Irv. play a lot. It's true. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Irv play a lot of smashes. Yeah. Shit, Irv could start a reasonable doubt. <laughs> yeah. Mm. And Irv, I, do yeah, I don't think people respect Irv's production credits. Y'all yeah. would lose just from Irv talking. <laughs> that's another. That's another salesman. Yeah. That's another salesman. Yeah. You have no idea. <laughs> yeah. He would stop the record 15 times before they oh, yeah, got yeah, to the verse. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> really and tell us a story about that studio session on ecstasy. Yeah. No, it's true. It's true. 
I really hope that this trend Shout out continues. To Shout out to all producers out there. Uh, want to highlight Hit Boy and Boy Wonder tonight. Want to shout out Swizz for inspiring. Inspiration is the greatest thing you can give to creative. I'm telling you, man. Mm-hmm. It really is. Thank you, Swiss. Thank you, Swiss. Thank you, mm-hmm. Timbaland. Um, all right, what we got? All right, two hours in. Let's get to the real shit, man. What you got for us, Roy? I've been waiting all week for the Maul breakdown on the Kardashian fight. All week long. Well, Chloe, what happened, Maul? Chloe texts Maul. What happened with your sisters, man? Yo, my sisters. <laughs> no, Chloe didn't text me. Only Maul can solve this. <laughs> A fight between <laughs> sisters? Yeah. Well, between the Kardashians, yeah. No. This was I don't like that. Look at Kim. The first one. I don't like the first person to throw the knee in the fight. I don't. (laughs) Uh, It's effective. What's the spacing? It's effective. What's the spacing? Sometimes a knee is the best option. Don't knee me. That's like I ain't like when. But I heard that's a real move though. When women fight, like the kick and the pussy. It's it's a real move when men fight. Um, (laughs) Yeah. If we're in real close, I'm throwing a knee. Yeah, I should have thought to do that when dude earth slammed me in front of crowns. No, but Kim really like this turned into a real fight. Like Kim slapped uh, the shit out of. Her. Uh, we didn't see it. You well, didn't see what it were they right saying in the group chat? No, no, no. She's not in that. She's uh, what's the other girl's name? She's no longer in the shot once the uh slaps and hands start throwing. No. Are you she suggesting that, that they slap. would fake something on the show, Joe? <laughs> no, that's a slap right bow. That's a slap. We don't see her. Is what I'm saying. I need Cece to break this down. <laughs> no, no, for real. But if it ain't happened on CC shit, nah, hey, my man, that's how I know I'm bored in the house. By the way, yesterday I was on CC shit for an hour just to see if this dude got smacked up on the block. <laughs> yeah, I missed that. They was like, "Yo, man, he out here walking around. <laughs> Yo, he think it's sweet." <laughs> nah, my, my man from Crime Faces definitely got to break this one down though. When this, yeah, when that's this my hit guy the air, too. Yeah, that's he got to break this. Nah, down. he's funny. He's real funny. Come on, Maul. Give us your breakdown. Yeah, like what was happening in the group what chat? What's, what's, what? I, I don't know what Y'all this was. Just Wait, was hold on, hold on, hold on. Y'all just toasted. Come on, man. <laughs> that was years ago, first of all. And here's uh, This seems like so, it's been a real issue between th- them. Th- this is what really bothers me with these types of things now. Maul is going to have to choose sides. Mm. And that's what really sucks here. Because I know he loves both of these women dearly. Yeah, no. It's yeah, Maul's the biggest loser in all this. Come on, come on, girls. Maul's the biggest. <laughs> <laughs> come on, ladies. Let's come just come on, girls. Let's just stop it. Let's just come on now. Don't do that. Don't kick people in the coochie. <laughs> do well, we know what they were? Why they were fighting? They've had some Smoke tension for a while. For, yeah, I think, uh, I think, it's, while about, I think about thirty-eight years of because what's, yeah. what's, what's, what's the other sister name again? Courtney. Courtney. O- uh, OJ. Courtney don't fuck with them. Courtney don't fuck with them. Yo, I forgot how amazing that ESPN uh, OJ doc is. Oh, that shit is amazing. Oh, yeah. I've watched it all week. Yeah, that's all they play. They, they done, yeah. They've done it. They did a really good job with that. The, and you know, last week when we were talking about the Tiger King, I'm really We saw mad. a girl fight during the OJ doc, too. That's ironic. Did we? On your rooftop in Edgewater. Rooftop, Edgewater. We were watching the OJ doc outside. <laughs> I remember now. I remember now. When we were talking about the Tiger King, I it may I, I forgot to bring up him speaking at his boyfriend's funeral. That I watched that. That he is the biggest, one of the biggest narcissists I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, like, he's was, up there. Yeah, he, it was uncomfortable. It was like, all right, fam, like you, you're just now. This is weird watching this shit. Like he's, he shouldn't have been singing at his boyfriend's funeral. But it made sense if you. If but you he's a singer. Got him, hits. He had condoms with his face on it. Like hey, that's fire. I th- I did think he was killing the merch game. <laughs> he was. I thought he was killing the singing game. Yeah. Hey, His video was, game was hey, crazy he was too. Gonna find a way to make some money. Hey, hey, he's suing somebody now for like ninety six million or some shit. Swag. Yo, he hey, is, he'll get it. Get this shit was off. like the weirdest fucking thing I've ever watched in like in a, in a years. This, this was just weird. This doc may, really makes you appreciate white people. <laughs> then the funny shit is both this, of the dudes was like, I'm not of... gay. <laughs> <laughs> like what? I saw that. I was like, "What are you?" He's like, "Yeah, I'm not gay." I was like, we're we're not. The, we are not the people to do it. But one day, I want somebody to have a conversation about gay predators turning straight people gay. Yeah, it happens a lot. It happens a lot. Man, and there was definitely something. It was definitely something to this. Like, that's that's funny. <laughs> oh, she, that's funny And she definitely Killed her husband Mandy 100% oh, yeah. <laughs> yes. Shorty uh, What's her name yeah. I'm yes. going with Carol yeah. Yeah. Carol yeah. Carol Carol definitely Killed her husband Oh without question Carol, Carol did that And Joe oh, definitely sure. Tried to get Carol Taken out 
Stacks. Yeah, Carol is way, three, way more of a sociopath. Grand. Three stacks? You tried to get a nigga off? That was like... Yeah, in a different yeah. state. You couldn't fuck with Carol once you get, went and got with Rock Nation, though. Yeah, that's nah. true. Yeah. <laughs> nah, that's true. And the business boomed. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Once you got next to Hove and looked at the contract. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But then they got nasty because now they all telling on each other. Like, Joe behind bars giving it up. He was like, Listen, I mean, I'm, if I'm going man, down, everybody's going down. Joe, Joe was putting <laughs> nah, out. Joe was already down. Joe put out singles during all this shit. Right. Man. All his songs were just Instagram captions. I liked them. And like, what was going on in his life? <laughs> yeah. Now was, Carol's yeah. going. It's like, wait. <laughs> the Carol diss video is better than any rap diss video that's ever, ever happened. Joe. What's his last name? Joe. Exotic. Exotic. Maldonado. Exotic, man. Oh. Don't hate exotic. Joe exotic. <laughs> he took my gay name. He did. <laughs> He definitely did. That was my 2022 name. Yeah. Joe Exotic. <laughs> Shorty that worked there was the G, though. That was she your rebrand arm ripped off and was game? back at work five days later. If yeah. I was gay, I would tell dudes I'm mixed. <laughs> what? <laughs> I think you do that now, though. <laughs> Who I tell I'm mixed, Rory? You told the pod. You went on and you said, Yo, I did my Ancestry.com. I'm mixed. <laughs> you told us. No, Rory. I told you that your ancestors raped mine my, did not. my ancestors. Mine did not at all. I told you, which is why I'm Mine were in Ireland minding their fucking business. Which <laughs> is why I'm mixed. And, and if, no, it's why I'm light-skinned. The fact that Rory brings it up so cavalierly makes me angry. Cavalierly. Bring you to a darker yeah. place? Yeah, I don't like that. Yeah. I don't like, I don't well, like. Joe, if you actually did your history, my ancestors were minding their business in Ireland. Probably drunk. Mining, the, uh, mining our fucking business. Are, are the are Ireland whites different? Y'all, did, y'all wasn't raping people? Oh, I'm sure we were getting our rape on, but yeah, that's what I'm saying. I, yeah, they was raping their cousins, though. Yeah, they was raping. Their yeah, no, no, no. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get us out of the rape. Oh, okay. but, <laughs> got it. Got yeah, it. yeah, but no, so why the, 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 sl- the slavery thing that wasn't us. Y'all was raping somewhere different. Yeah, well, no, no, we were being <laughs> raped by the English. That's a fact. We just all have the same pale skin. So y'all like the black whites? It's been yes. No. There's a term for it. <laughs> no, 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 no. Who's the black whites? There are no black whites. Well, who's the I'm going to dig deeper into the Irish. No, there is a term for it. I will not be giving the term of what Irish people are to Europe. It's bad? It's the N-word. For real? The N-words of Europe is what Irish people refer to. Well, how do y'all feel about that? Not great. <sighs> not great. Well, when y'all going to step to them niggas? We did. We we started a whole. <laughs> we started a. Y'all supposed to be down yeah. with us then? No, we the uh, we started a whole war and a whole IRA that then. It's it's a long story. Yeah. Northern Ireland, it's it's cool. I got to do my googles on y'all. Yeah, no, we were. I don't know um, enough about Irish history. Is pretty about uh, white pretty history. It's weird. No, no, and don't get it twisted. Once we all got here. Irish people were certainly racist. I'm not going to get that away from anything. We just got here late, and we was like, oh, that's what y'all on? Bet. <laughs> Jumped right on board? <laughs> yeah, no, no. Irish people was right oh, there. So y'all on a bandwagon, whites? Uh, sure. We was trying to fit in. You know, it was, it was no shoes, no shirt, no Irish in the windows. So we were like, well, if they hate the black people, guess, yeah, we, guess we have to try, too. Yeah, but y'all made bridges. That is true. Well, that's, why, Jameson. Lot, that's why a lot of... Um, oh. That's why a lot of <laughs> that's why a lot of uh, black people have Irish last names because Irish people were sent to the West Indies to be servants. Rory, why do you keep bringing up shit that would make us feel a way as black? I don't want to hear why we have your name. You were you were we were talking about yeah, the history, but, yeah, and I was nah. giving it to you. But let's end it. Okay. <laughs> fair, fair enough. Fair enough. Um, let's listen to podcast. <laughs> what else we got? Drake is, Drake is producing some shit. Forty eight laws or something. Oh yeah. And like I, 48 I, Laws of 40? Did you and see I did, 50 on uh, For Life? I didn't see the new episode of For Life uh, or Dave yet. Oh, okay. Oh, man. Dave was new, heavy. I heard the new episode of Dave was real good. It was heavy. You saw it, right? Yeah. Oh. I didn't see it. But what were you saying about Drake thing? I'm sorry. Did I, uh, I was just going to say that uh, r- rappers graduating is not celebrated enough. Mm. Uh, and Drake is a bad example of that because he's the, been the most dominant rapper. But And the most celebrated. Drake, 50, just that I love that when rappers are getting into their producer content. But I really, really like it. it does, I liked it when Drake, Drake did that with uh, Euphoria. Top Boy. Euphoria was great. Euphoria is yeah. phenomenal on HBO. He did Top Boy too? Yeah. He was, oh, wow. Well, he's, um, for he's bringing it back. Yeah. He brought it back. But no, Euphoria is fucking great. I can't wait for season two. That would be your, your rap name. Euphoria? Yep. I would I like that. Yeah. yeah, I'm not mad at that. It's not bad. Yeah, I don't know why I'm all hated it. on Phenomenon like that. Phenomenon. <laughs> Sell no records with that name. You better have Phenomenon in that fucking Phenomenon. Phenomenon. <laughs> no, oh, and if no. you got in a battle with somebody, they would destroy your name. F- 
phenomenon is not it's, spelled it's with an F. Uh-oh. It's a PH. <laughs> uh oh, y'all. Come on, Maul. Uh oh, y'all. <laughs> uh. Harlem, we back. No, we're not. Uh. It's a Harlem E beat. It is. Uh. uh. Only because y'all can hear Mace on it. Young phenomenon. Yeah. We here. Brooklyn. <laughs> Brooklyn. <laughs> Yo. Oh, no, no, you wouldn't do that. No, no. bring it back. Nah, he might, though. Uh, come on, Maul. No, I don't want to come. Uh, Raheem. <laughs> nah. <laughs> you would break it up in between the beat. Fee. That uh, is a nasty here nah. Here to give you the plug talk. Uh, uh-huh. The safe under the rug talk. Uh, the safe is under the rug in your verse. <laughs> yes, it is. See, this I'm is not, a big one. Right, by, by the way, by the way it's not a hole in the, in the floor either. It's just, it's just a safe a under the rug. <laughs> <laughs> The, the rug is on top of it Just in the middle of the room <laughs> the Like yo what's rug. that Nah that's nothing <laughs> Nah that's, that's yeah. my rug yeah. That's yeah. my that's rug not. Walk around Just, walk. Yeah. Just walk around <laughs> Nah we getting out We leaving Now we leaving I'm getting out We playing sleepers <laughs> nah, walk, nah. walk around that That's my rug Yeah walk around that Walk around that <laughs> Yo Get it safe under the rug is for now. You gotta, you gotta finish that You gotta give another four after that <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh Yes. Where's, BX. E- where's Erickson's verse? Yo, yo, <laughs> I step out the project Jordan Sixes, serving the fiends all these bricks is. Let's go, <laughs> Maul. Let's go. Phenomenon. I would He's know. not finished. <laughs> I was waiting for you to tie in Brixes with Vixens somehow. <laughs> what? Just waiting for you to tie in Brixes Brix's with Vixens somehow. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, listen, don't growl and look at me like that one, nigga. Fucking with the Spanish mommies while they snort this Vixes. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, can we leave? I just want to get out of here. Just All right, then go, go ahead. I just want to go. Just hey, go. go ahead. Then. No. Cook. Cook. No, I don't want to cook. You right by the stove. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Forget it, man. <sighs> if I just ended the normal, I ended the normal way then. That works. I mean, it's a time for a Now, now when you did, it's time to change how we yeah, ended, no, don't yeah, you? Don't think? No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> stay right there. No, I think we should end every podcast with, with a like, ball rap with a, a three bars from somebody. <laughs> three bars, <laughs> just to get three off, <laughs> real quick, and then get out. Of don't add up in no type of way. No, no, nah, give, me ten, give me ten minutes to write. Shut up, Roy. Uh I'm rushing home to this beat battle. I am. We don't, I mean, we don't have to rush. Yeah, I'm going to drive slow. We got f- I'm we not have, outside often. We have four hours. And, God, it, and God, there's no traffic. God, is, and not, that's the one thing that is great about all of this. Mm-hmm. There's not a car oh, on the road. God. I get everywhere in 20. I can get to D.C. from here in 20 minutes. <laughs> Easily. <laughs> yeah, no, it's true. I appreciate that. Uh, listen, y'all stay safe out there. Remember, practice social distancing, even though we are not on Tuesdays and Fridays. Um... <laughs> Just keep your head up, man. Tupac cares if don't nobody else care. Uh, life is a series of moments and moments pass, so let's make this one last as if it's all that we have. Until the next time, keep us in your prayers. Lord knows we need to be there. Until next time, I bid you adieu. Farewell. Adios. Arriva Dirty. So long. Goodbye. Oh, we didn't never said rest in peace, Frank Jugger. Yo, yeah, I wanted to dedicate this episode. I'll dedicate the next episode to Frank, Frank, Frank Jugger. Jugger. Rest in peace, Curly Neal. Yes. Um, try to legend. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Um, uh, when you was talking about LeBron showing his sneakers, I wanted to mention. Uh, uh, did you think it was corny when PJ Tucker did it? Because he did it, he does something like that too. No, but and he, he has a sneaker. That's store, what he's known for. He has a sneaker store open in Houston, also. PJ, yeah, but that's what he's known for. Yeah, now your bitch is gonna want to go into it. And, and I heard there's a new sneaker store down there. I know it's a sneaker store over here too. <laughs> <laughs> Fly into a sneaker store. Falaka right here too. <laughs> they've done worse. Yes, that's, that's, <laughs> they, they, that's very they, true. They, they've flown to nothing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they've flown to nothing. I heard, I heard New Orleans has they good just, food. They just be hype about the flight. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they make good cakes. Yeah. I know, I know. Yeah, hey, they show us a picture of the fucking first class seat. Never the flying to nothing. No, no, no. Never the nothing no. you land to. Yeah, no, yeah. All right, let me stop hating. Kehlani, we love you. Yes. Janae, we love you. Any other songstress that thinks we hate them, we love you. All women. Uh, Jay Electronica, we, we, we love you. We love women. And we do love Jay Electronica. <laughs> Jay Electronica pieced it up with me a little bit. He came yeah, I saw my, that. Came, oh, what happened? He came my Insta Live. He uh, apologized for his Nagardly actions the other night. That's a big word. Well, that's a Jay Elect word. Okay. I That that let me know he meant it. Yeah, okay. <laughs> like, nah, you was a little Nagardly. <laughs> 
He was in the guarding? A little bit. Just a little bit. <laughs> like, we should be able to critique some shit and leave. Like, it's not personal. It's so, yeah, it's, it's okay not, to it's not personal. Yeah, it's never it's personal. It's never, never, ever, ever personal never with me. Personal. Ever personal with me. Um, Unless, Unless it's fab. <laughs> We're gonna, we're gonna look at that at the half. We're gonna. <laughs> <laughs> They're gonna review that. that in New York. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That in the booth. Yeah, yeah. Yo, man, enjoy yourselves. Stay safe out there, and we will be back on Wednesday, God willing.